The thoughts, views, and opinions expressed by this podcast as well as its hosts are for entertainment purposes only. I repeat, it is not serious. It is not real. No one is exposing, revealing, indicting, or telling you anything about themselves. Also, we do not encourage you to try this at home. We are trained professionals who do not have your best interests at heart or our own. <laughs> Enjoy the show. Do you hear no, it? No, I'm you, telling you. You, you want to start with me? I'm, uh, oh, <laughs> to start with I'm a, me. Oh, we're starting with black on. She that, started with me. I can hear that through your I'm singing. Sitting. And I knew the song the right away. <laughs> you guys know sometimes I'm a little challenged in that department, but I knew the song <laughs> right away. He hadn't even gotten to the name of the song. And I said, I could tell the name through your singing. Yeah. He took it as a fucking insult. Mm. The fuck? Not even I mean, through. Stop being so I, sensitive. She said, I can tell yeah, that God. even through your singing. The fuck out of here. <laughs> Where did I learn that? <laughs> What's going on? I can hear something. Okay. All right. All right there we go. All right, we I know you're not talking. Your phone is regularly Oh, going. she on your ass. She on your ass, bro. She got all black on, too. Yeah. She's shooting. She got the femme fatale look going yeah. on. <laughs> Witness protection program. There you over go. Here. Oh, got it, I got like it. it. It's a good look for you. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. You are so not. You'll blend in great so in Nebraska. You are so not in the witness protection program. <laughs> I know, right? Let me move my mic back so it don't sound like I'm yelling at Mel <laughs> when I start yelling at Mel. <laughs> <laughs> I want to sound normal. How's everybody doing? I'm feeling, feeling well, man. Feeling Woody good. Who? Ish is not here. Why? Was he getting done his body again? He's getting his butt did. <laughs> yeah, he's getting his butt did today. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? He's getting a colonoscopy, Listen, which no, all of you... He's what? getting a BBO. No, God, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> that is why he went and got his yeah, shit that's, done that's down there. For here. sure. Yeah. yeah, you don't want to show up. He just told you He wanted that. shit to look good. You don't want to show up for butt stuff looking crazy, you know? Yeah. I don't want to show up for the butt stuff. <laughs> that's an appointment I'm going to miss. Anything with my ass? Oh, nah, God, dude. Man. Nah, I'll fart it out. Oh, come on. Yeah. <laughs> right, whatever's going on, I'll get it out that way. Shout out to But Ish, Ish is at the age, man. Go ahead. Because it is important. Ish can stay is. home. He left me with a ton of content from the last part. So <laughs> I ain't off of that. I'll be referring to it all. I've been thinking about that since he said it. That nigga's crazy. <laughs> he tried to slip that in there, too. That's what really, really funny. Did, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. I went and, you know. It, the, the, holy shit. What did he get? Funny. Landscaping? Manscaping? He got, he got, he got laser. lasered. <laughs> <laughs> oh. He got his regions, laser hair. Hold on, G give her a minute. Yeah, yeah. Okay. She's Whoa. trying to clog yourself. <laughs> Damn. I'm sorry, this is so fucking gold. Okay, keep... Mm, okay. <laughs> yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. That was it. Mm. And that was funny. That is amazing. That was funny. So it's just not here because he's doing some more shit to his body. Yeah. I don't know what about podcasts that makes people want to do everything to their body. It's the camera, man. <laughs> It is the camera. It's the camera. Yeah, but we ain't seen his fucking pubes. <laughs> you don't know what he be doing at home, yo. God damn. He might have OnlyFans. That's true. That wouldn't shock me. <laughs> so, <for> finance OnlyFans. <laughs> Butt ass. Butt ass. Butt ass. <laughs> Some real estate. Naked, fi naked real estate shit. I can raise your portfolio and raise. Freak ass boy. <laughs> Oh man, so Ish is not here because uh, he's doing some shit to his, to his ass. Yo, stop saying that, <laughs> man. Flip is not here because he's doing some he's shit. Doing he's some doing shit. some shit. Yeah, he's doing some shit, and he keep trying to call and update Ian with what he's doing. I only seen Ian for forty five minutes. Every other ten minutes, Flip is on the phone with a new update mm -hmm. with what he's doing. Ian just keep walking around like just accept mad accepting to what he's saying. Man, pass me the phone. That's an old school trick. Yeah, let me get that phone, dog. Is, yeah. Hey, dog, I don't give a fuck about none of this emergency shit you talking about. I'll see you when you when you get here. So hurry up. Hurry up, valued staff member. See what you were supposed to be like. All right, dog, you know what? We're going to hold it down, handle your business. That's what the updates that's what they be want. For. That's what yeah, they yeah, want yeah, you to that's say. What the they for. want you to be like, they want you to be like, oh, no, man, you got all that going on. We got to cover today. Don't even come in. Nah. nah. I ain't going to hold you. Nah. Get here, get here when you one get time. Here. Well, after we potted, I had to go get my daughter. And he was like, yo, just let me know how you doing. You know, it's about an hour trip. I hit you <laughs> back. I was like, yo, I just picked her up. You know, it's about whatever time it was. Crickets. He was like, oh, no, nah, we ain't start yet. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Oh yeah, come on in. Yeah. We ain't start yet. Roll out the whole up. red carpet for you. <laughs> this ain't a nine to five. We don't close it. At yeah, 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 yeah. Seven yeah, yeah. p.m. That's or something. A fact. That's a fact. We was chilling your whole ride up the turnpike. Yeah. So that's why I'm I'm cool with yeah. Flip, get your ass in here. Yeah, yeah come on. Yeah. Come yeah, on, we'll buddy. Sit. We'll sit right here. Come yeah, on. whenever you arrive, waiting on you. Yeah, you know I mean. It. Big Mel is back, huh? Hey, hey. Big ah, Mel is on back. Y'all. Jokes on y'all. I saw it. I saw it. Take that. Now, take that one. I did have a clip that I wanted to play. Oh. Just, it, you know, just because I kind of saw a little okay. bit, a little bit of the rumblings and stuff like that. But no. I can't play it because, you know, this is oh, a little, yeah, you little, the, little you situation. Yeah, you should time get for your, a new phone. phone. Yeah, yeah. Not, okay. Well, time to, for a new phone. But it was that clip from uh, Wolf. Well, send it to me. I'll play it. Okay. Yeah. It, it, it's very apropos. Oh, uh, apropos. Yeah. I want to hear what's apropos. <laughs> Alpo, you're gonna love it. I want to hear you're what, what Mel thinks is apropos right now. Okay. That's like really Alpo. What's out? Al, what's Al, yeah. apropos? Yeah, it means you can't just be using it's words. Appro- it's appropriate. It's oh, relevant. It's appropriate. Then. Okay, yeah, yeah, sorry. Yeah. She wanted to get fancy. It's timely. You know Mel. At this it's point. timely. It's it's She's gonna use the fancy word. Yeah. Ice. I'm just telling you. Gotta crawl before you walk. Man. I know, but that's a very. I don't doubt you. I don't doubt you. I believe you put your mind to something, you can achieve it. But you you, you got to get there, though. I'm going to get you right. I'm going to get you right. Yeah, there you go. Oh, Some man. Some people you just got to leave alone, though. Ice, I, I know that you new niggas with these phones just started putting playlists together. You talking to me saying that. I've been doing this since High Five, I Like, Madonna, Vogue, Dog, I'm from the Paula Abdul, <laughs> Straight Up Now, Tell Me, Do You Really Want to Love Me Forever? You mean Jacob? Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Stop playing with me. I've been doing this since Jody Watley. <laughs> Stop playing with me. Okay. I've been doing this. Karen White. A long time I've been putting this together. A long time. Fuck are you talking about? Yeah, I'm not Watch your mouth. You, bro. Watch your mouth crawl you before gotta, you walk. You gotta crawl, crawl at forty three. <laughs> <laughs> now he gonna learn you. How's that? She can't. No, he gonna learn you. He can't. No, he's gonna he learn. He can't. You. Some people just play the music. Some people listen to music. Some people feel the music. Some people got it running through their veins. Mm. I, I hear you. I was I three you. years old grabbing the kitchen pots. Out the project kitchen, nigga, playing recognizable tunes mm. at three. Don't make mm. me call my mom up here. I'm not the rest of these niggas. Mm. I'm not mm. dumb. I'm not dumb. That's all funny. What's up, though? You're standing in front of one of them. What's up, though? Mm-hmm. What's happening with you? I seen him last night. He was too drunk to stand up. He don't want to see me. <laughs> he don't want to see me. That's about though. How's everybody doing? Yeah, that, yeah, 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 true. That was hate just now, too. It yeah, was. That was hate. Was. How's everybody doing? How's everybody feeling? What's going on? Fantastic. Feeling amazing. Come on, let's feeling get a temp good. check. Feeling good. Let's get a temp check. Feeling good. Feeling amazing. Man. How was your weeks? I had a very long week. Um, well, first, let me just start. You know, I, I, I've got to complain again. Uh-oh. Oh, I love it. Okay. Yo, y'all with these badass kids, y'all need to keep a like a leash or oh, something. Shit. Keep your kid next to you. <laughs> no, nah, dog, I took my daughter to the dentist this week. Uh-huh. Empty waiting room when we get in there. I love it. But you know, they take a minute behind the counter. Sure. Okay. They got the little play area for the kids with some blocks and shit on it. Mm-hmm. Walking in, we hear screaming. But mm-hmm. not like a baby crying, like there's you know, something wrong with him screaming. Like just, what's wrong with this kid? Is he okay? Right. Little kid coming in like the Tasmanian devil. Grabbing shit, throwing the magazines, banging on the windows. My daughter is peaceful, quiet, playing with the blocks. I'm like, all right. Don't bring that rambunctious shit around my door. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, so I inch a little bit closer. I'm watching him. He's working his way around the room. The mother just sitting there, Mm-mm. not saying a word to him. She's tone deaf to it. It's going to be deaf deaf in mm-hmm. a minute. So I'm like, if he come over here by her, I'm, I'm in leg reach because I'm already, I'm, I'm, yep, I'm measuring. I'm like, it was I'm, a reflex. Sorry. I'm going to boot this little bit. I'm definitely he, tripping him. No, it was going to be one of those, like oh, Sparta. Good. Yeah. He was catching it. It was a boy. So, you know. Oh, yeah. You he was catching it to the chest. You, yeah. Boom. <laughs> The he didn't get near her though. To the face. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't get near her, but then I'm just sitting there like, yo, even the, the people in the back behind the desk, they coming out looking what's going on, and this little fucker is just going crazy. Mom just sitting there just. So I'm just saying, if you have bad kids or kids who don't know how to act in public, don't bring them out nowhere. The new shit is to yeah. just let them rock, I feel like. I've seen a lot of people that are That's our the, age having kids and like they be on some yeah tie yourself out yeah that or, ain't gonna or, work or, or you have to let them express themselves yeah, 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 yeah. you can't hinder their self-expression 
And it's it's hard as like a, a non parent to be mm-hmm. like, that's please bullshit. yell at your fucking kid. <laughs> no, that's bullshit. You guys because have you never... have to teach your kids structure. You have to teach your kids discipline. Because if you don't, they're gonna grow up to get to a certain age, and guess what? They're gonna learn oh, out there. Shut up. You just gotta smile at the adult while your kid is kicking them and spitting on them. <laughs> you just gotta throw a little nice smile. Like, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> all right. That's all you gotta do. Come near mine. Come near my daughter with all of that shit. You're getting kicked. And not, nothing else will really let you know what you truly think about humanity other than thinking for your kid when they're around humans. Like, when your kid is just around humans, <laughs> you'd be like, yeah. oh, come on, baby, walk over here. Yeah, yeah, guys, come on, come on, come on. Just stay away from that yeah. dirty nigga over want you there. there. Yeah, stay over here. You, you guys have never felt compelled to, like, Beat tell... somebody kid ass? Oh, I'm sorry. No, but no, no. Tell somebody, can you control can you do something it about was this? Get, it was getting ready to get there like though. i'm saying like let's just say you're on nope. an, let's just say you're like on a plane nope oh, and no, no, no. Nope. some kid is just like you know i'm trying to help you on the i'm asking nope real question you can't even ask that nope the answer is no <sighs> yeah you got a bunch that, of business that's how the beef break out yeah no matter what a kid is doing on that plane you cannot turn around and say something to the parent about what's going on with the kid you can't do that hmm. under no circumstance that is how fights break out okay we might have to, I mean, I'm not trying to get it there, but you got to do something. I'm not going to sit here and let your little kid just kick my seat the whole fucking flight. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. I am not. What I'm are gonna, you going to do? I'm going to ask the parent, and in a, in a, if you take it that way, you take it that way, but I'll do it in a respectful way. Yo, can you please? Your, your, your child is um, really kicking the seat. Oh, yeah, or, yeah, or, or I'm going to hit the button. Ding. Yo, you hit the button and do what? Yo, else? y'all y'all talk to him. Tattle. Snitch. Yeah, I'm a snitch. <laughs> hit the button. Yo, yo, yo. You ain't never even seen one of them stewardess girls talk to somebody, a uh, kid, or talk to somebody about their kid. Y'all crazy. I'm telling you, I'm not just going to sit there. I- I'm trying to sleep on this flight. I'm drunk. I'm trying to go to sleep. I'm not going to be the whole flight. No way. No way. Mm-hmm. I'm going to say something to somebody on that plane. Y'all deal with it. I might not say it to the parent. I ain't taking Especially my if it's kid a woman, trip I'm not yet, gonna say nothing. Boy, to her. do I, boy, is that like one of my worst fears? Like taking my kid through an airport and on a plane with like dirty people mm. or people I'm, like like that. They want to say something to you about your kid, man. Well, my kid gonna be. We will jump you with this iPad. <laughs> <laughs> and that's another reason that we're not gonna be here too long. Day is my baby's birthday. Hey! 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 Hell yeah! So I gotta hurry up and leave here and fucking <laughs> watch the tracking. The tracking device app. <laughs> <laughs> busy, busy evening. Hey. 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 hey, hey, hey! I ain't saying nothing. <laughs> Why is that so funny? That's horrible to say. Is it? I'm joking. I'm joking, of course. But yeah, nah, fuck that. <laughs> I ain't done that in a while. Just pop up as the dad to some shit you ain't invited to. <laughs> Hey, 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 I know all y'all names. Hey, Catherine. <laughs> you be a hey, shit. hey, Lolita. What's up? <laughs> we can't even have fun. No, right. no. Let's take no. a bit. Happy birthday to my baby. Birthday, I love, love birthday, you. We love you, Lex. Yes, yes, yes. All right, now, come Before on. Let's start. I want to send a get well soon to my lady, Miss um, Freeze, as we all call her. She's currently in the hospital right now. So, baby, I love okay? you. Thinking about you. Yeah, she's fine. Okay. Get well soon. Yes, get well, get well soon. soon. Get well soon, Miss mm-hmm. Freeze. Come on, the missing piece. That's right. It's my Can't missing have piece. the missing piece missing. I'll be True. there. I'll see you later. Bro. Yeah, come on, man. Yeah, take that fucking beard in there. Go see what's going on. <laughs> That's been my other favorite part of the week of seeing the fans. That was great. Oh, my oh, God. Yeah. That was great. You and Asia really lit it up That recently. was great. I've been having a blast with that. They said ice is, ice is in a disguise. <laughs> <laughs> no, somebody told me. I, this was the fake one. Like, this shit is Velcro, and I put it on top of my beard. That's hilarious. I was crying, yo. It's been, y'all been, y'all been said, funny. Yeah, they, y'all been, they funny. been calling you. They said you was a distraction. <laughs> <Yo>. <laughs> then they called you measly to block captain. Yeah, yeah that was funny. <laughs> Sleazy to block. Oh, my God. Oh, oh shit. I had a good time with them. Man, freeway memes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. my God. Good, good shit, good shit. It is just like the blackest die, though. It really is. Why you get the blackest dye? That's what I wanted. Is there a different black dye? It's a bunch of them. It's different shades of black. Oh, yeah, come on. The man. soft black, yeah. off black. Off black. You went jet. <laughs> that nigga went for the blackest of the black. <laughs> Bow chicken, wow, yeah. wow. He want, he want to appropriate an all black. <laughs> oh, shit. He want to make sure that niggas know. Nah, well, I'm out here appropriating. 
<laughs> yeah, I'm the, the blackest the, the, of blacks. The benefit of my beard, yo, real talk, if I, the second I say, all right, I don't like this shit anymore, I shave this whole shit off and in a week and a half, it'll be back the way it looks. Same. So it's like, I can have fun with it. I don't give a fuck. Same. Okay. Same. So? How'd Mrs. Freeze feel about it? Because a lot, I know a, women, we tend to like the salt and pepper. We like she it. She loved the salt and pepper. She yeah. was like, this is, takes some getting used to. Got Because okay. she's used to seeing me a certain way. Mm. But she's with it, though. Anything okay. that Ice do dramatic with his appearance, I automatically assume that Miss Freeze has urged him into it. Mm. Oh, no, nah, that, that wasn't, I, I told y'all yeah, why I did that. Yeah, you said you did yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, nah, fuck that. I was ready to fight that lady in the store. <laughs> I don't believe that story for a second. <laughs> All right. Not for uh, one Maybe call my mom. She was like, yo, calm down. No, nigga. <laughs> the fuck? No. Niggas do not want to look their age. Or, I don't mind looking my age. I don't want to look like my mother's father. <laughs> I, she did not look like your mother's father. But whatever. <laughs> one uh, little CVS cop that <laughs> Yeah, word. Nah, that shit hit different, man. That, that, that was like that hit a gut punch. Not from Mister. I don't give a fuck what these niggas is Word. talking about. I don't That's give a fuck with these Monica. niggas. That's my mama right there next to me. That wasn't your mama that said it. Nah, but she ain't exactly like disagree. <laughs> <laughs> she, she, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? She went she along. Really She's like, like Where, where'd you get that? <laughs> I was like, yo, like, oh no, 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 thank you. <laughs> was it? She was talking to me. We, oh yeah, no, God. we gonna we gonna do something about this. All right, there's mad shit to get to. There's yes. mad shit to get there to. Is. I'm not gonna be here all day because I got I gotta go look at my app. So <laughs> eat that ass. Too. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna see what's going on popping. Right, I did. You tell me to leave too. I I have to pee. <laughs> try to give me a leave. I'm gonna have to piss. I'm gonna have to use the bathroom. Number two, long one. Long, yeah, no, Joe is yeah. still in the bathroom. <laughs> you ain't left yet. Hell yeah. Uh, where do y'all want to start? Oh man. Wherever oh. you want to start. You wanna start with Nikki? There hasn't been a lot of music, but there's been a lot of music shit. Yeah, there's mm -hmm. been a lot of music. Yeah. Shit. We can start with Nikki. We can. Okay. I'm totally cool with that. Um, Elliot has to customize. He has to find a way to customize his hate. No, he don't. Differently. He yes, he does. I he think he's it. enjoying the hate. Yeah. I think he's trolling with the hate. I don't know about troll. I guess it's trolling. I think he's, he's looking for engagement. Hate. Yes. Yes. Exactly yes. what he's doing. Because the reason why is because he's reposting every, he's retweeting everything everybody's saying about his hate. Correct. So, yes, he's trolling with the hate. But I'm I just still saying think he needs really to hate. Too. There's a different way to hate, though. I'm not against the hate, but the hate could come off a little less Haiti. <laughs> sassy, like spiced, like hmm. it could be a firm hate. <laughs> but saying he's not a journalist, like oh, journalist these days, or whatever he's saying. Hip hop journalism. Yeah. Hip -hop journalism. You know what I And think? I like Spicy Ellie, by the way. I do. I, I don't I, want him to lose the spice. No, nah, that's funny. But it's funny to but an extent, but he he gives the he coming off as the old dude who well, this is the way we did it back then. Well, this is not back then, my nigga. Well, hold up a second. What's wrong with that? Get in, Nothing. Get, yeah, get into it. Ain't nothing wrong with it, but you get need to understand it. that this is not back then. So I can still sit here and hate, and we and everybody can laugh at you. Yeah, like all right, cool, my nigga. That's how you did it back then. And there is so something look. wrong with that, right? Like I'm with those people because I know those people and used to be that person, mm -hmm. but. You don't want to use all your goodwill and equity and your power and your audience to make it seem like you just have a real lack of understanding for whatever is new age or whatever is forthcoming or whatever's in the forecast. Well, you can't be the guy that's just, hey, I'm stuck in what I'm stuck in and anybody else that's doing it a different way, I got to beef with that. Right? It, well, well, what happens is, is I'll, oh, I'm sorry. Oh, go ahead. Because I was the man this way. When, when it was done this way. Mm -hmm. I was him. Mm -hmm. So now I'm watching other people become like them in a totally different way, and I can't fuck with that over there, so I hate on it. See, I, see and that's, that's what where, he's doing. that's just a little different for me. I, Elliot is the man to me. I'm, but he's not, all right. Elliot in any room that he walks in brings Elliot with him and all that he's done. Mm -hmm. Correct. Elliot is the man for me. He don't need to always say, Yo, I did double XL. I did this interview. I did that. Sometimes his reputation so, precedes him. Yeah, sometimes yeah. just being so loud about what you've done takes away from what you've done. He's him already. Correct. You can't be the old the OG that has a problem with other people becoming them. Like That's what Kai, he's doing. Kai Sinat deserves to be him. A absolutely, and he is him. Yeah, he but is. he deserves he's, he's to be it. looked at like him, yes. treated like yes. him, viewed yes. like him. He's mm -hmm. him in the space. If y'all don't understand the streaming shit or, or whatever the fuck he's doing in that basement or the jail shit, then shut the fuck up. 
And that was me too mm-hmm. at, at some point. I was like, hey, what the fuck is going on? Mm-hmm. But as soon as I hear streaming, I know what's going on. I know what's happening. It's a different game. It's not journalism. It's, well, that's the thing well, is like he's speaking from the standpoint of being a purist. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like he yeah. is a journalist. There's room for the purists. Yeah. Yeah. There's room for the new kids. There's room for the Playboy Cardi new rocker people. There's uh-huh. just room for everybody. There yeah. is. It's, and it's again, it's not journalism. I mean, he's not pretending to be a journalist. He's not trying to be a journalist. Never said he's he was a, a streamer. Yeah. Like, yeah. This is the part that Elliot and people who believe like him are missing, who don't understand why the artists are running to the streamers today. Streaming is marketing. Mm-hmm. The part that they're forgetting is your journalism was also marketing. It was just that that was the marketing for that time. Right. Them artists ain't want to sit with y'all either. They're True. doing that because this is how I got to get my album promoted. This is, I need to sit here. You are the man of whatever is print right at that moment. You are the man in print or it's radio. You are the man in radio. I got to come sit with you. I don't want to do that. Now the game has evolved. So now it's your castanets and people of that era in the streaming world. Mm-hmm. Now it's okay, Nikki, I want to get out there and, and uh, whatever the hot thing is right now. Okay. It's streaming. I want to, I have to go sit with him. I don't have to go sit with the person who was the man in print or the man in radio. I don't have to necessarily do that. But it's all it was always marketing. It's just the pieces on the board change. It's the same game. And though. she did that interview with him, and then he brought, brought him out for her show when she performs that Everybody record in Atlanta. Hmm. So now, I mean, it's just, it crosses over. There's more, it's like a Swiss Army knife. Right. It's yeah. not just yeah. I'm sitting down with him to talk. Right. It's... I need you to come to my show and bring that energy while you're dancing with the young people. And mm-hmm. it's a package. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes. Mm-hmm. Anybody that got a problem with 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 that way of moving around need to figure out how to be adaptive, that's or just a, be okay with being a dinosaur. traditional hardcore a, journalist, a like. dinosaur. And that's not going to work for where this shit is headed with AI at all. I'm just telling you now. I feel like I've told you already, but I'm telling you now. Either find a way to be adoptive. And find a way that all of these new age technology tricks can fucking help your business or just be stuck talking about the 90s. And I ain't just talking about Elliot. I talk about the 90s a lot. I, I sat one day, just did some math. I'm bad at math. I was like, God damn. That shit was further further back than I could. Yeah. It was. Yeah. For niggas mm-hmm. that wasn't in it, once you start doing math, we about mm-hmm. to be in 2024. Mm-hmm. Nigga, you talking about 25, 30 years ago now. Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's too long to be hearkening back. Yeah. yeah, it's too long to be harking back. So she she just, in that moment when you having a beer with your niggas that was, was there, there, or when you time. reminiscing, or y'all got your war stories. But when you talking to these kids today that was just born when the towers fell, nineties dog. Mm-hmm. There's room for both, in my opinion. There's room for streamers and there's room for journalists and podcasters. Like both are valuable in their different ways. Yeah, but one shouldn't be hating on the other. Agreed. That's all I'm saying. I like a little bit of hate, but I like fun. hate. Mm-hmm. I do yeah. like the hate. It's hate, fun. hate ain't getting you no money, I, man. Fuck that. Ah. <laughs> I don't know if he got a little monetization on Twitter. That shit might have went up. Right. And what the hate does, it tells you that Elliot is still very passionate about what he does and and feels a way that he's not securing some of the interviews. And it's not just him though. I like that that I like that that passion exists. But it ain't just him. Nor he crash out whenever he's a CC interview go out that, that he was supposed to have. True. He ain't like none of that Cardi shit. Let me shut up about it, because I think they pieced it up. But <laughs> that nigga was on Twitter going off. He was. Cardi, you motherfucker. He went off. No, no, he went off a hove. <laughs> yeah. No, he said, hove went sad with Gail. He said it nice. I would like for him to be able to come in. But you know what he was saying? He read between uh, the lines. Mad podcasters do this shit. I feel like I'm the only nigga that don't do it, actually. That's because you're not looking to interview. I don't give a... You know, I want to stay away from these niggas. Mm-hmm. Or, I want to stay away from I all remember, of them. I remember... <laughs> Understandably he, so. After He did that when um when Banks came up here with us. Yeah. He oh, yeah, he went he off. He was hot. He went off on us when Banks came up yeah, here. Yeah, he did. We, you was listening to that Kanye uh, rant in, on uh, Insta Live. Yo, 2024, Insta Live, we need to throw it in the garbage. Nah, Insta Live. Nah, nah, I can't say. Throw it out. And it's dope. I don't know. If you are an entertainer... You can now um, you can now stream it properly. Oh look! Oh fuck! Wait, excuse me. You can use um, music like OBS and shit to stream. Oh really? Mm-hmm. Translation help for the oh. challenge. Well, now you have to like you can use like real setups now with Instagram as of like a couple days ago. 
to oh, like as far oh, as you, if you things. want to have DSLRs and mics and like yeah, yeah, yeah. have it rocking. You can broadcast. Yeah, you can broadcast instead properly of just from Instagram. Holding your phone now, and yeah. Like the way we do the YouTube shit on uh um Pods Given, like you could do that with Instagram. I might have to you might have now just... you can give away your IP with better quality. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> now <laughs> it is a big jump. That's, a, that's important. That, that, that's important. Don't sound like a dinosaur now. No, I'm in the future. I'm not in the past. If if they're doing that with all of these fucking new capabilities, mm-hmm. then I'd like to see changes made with how they're uh, structuring deals with oh, sure. uh, tastemakers, influencers, and artists. Sure, oh, but you can do that. You can do that with subscription shit. But anyway, oh please, I don't, wanna, don't yeah. talk no, to no, me. No, 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 don't no. talk to me. See, that's where we go wrong as a people. Don't talk to me about what the tech is offering. Uh, what they're offering to anybody that uses it. I'm not talking. I ain't anybody that use it. Some of the people that get this shit popping ain't anybody that use it. Call those people directly and do deals. The right deals. They're not going to do that. I don't know that they're not doing it. Expand that program. I don't know they're not doing they it. They probably are doing that. I don't think they're doing that. They're definitely doing it. They're definitely doing it. I know it. people that are making money off Instagram they're, before the subscription shit. Yeah, they're definitely like, doing the it. The reels I'm talking and shit about like right that. now, I don't think I don't they're know calling they're out right to anyone second. making a deal. Not Instagram. Instagram is Facebook. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They're 100% doing that. I'm telling you. Okay. They're doing that. But let me know. I'm fine. Listen, they're doing that for 1% of people. So if you want to use the tools, go ahead. But the rest of us, we got to (laughs) fight for your right (laughs) to party. I'm going to always want to disrupt some shit. I'm a rebel, nigga. That's true. (laughs) You you mentioned mentioned, uh, Kanye. What do you think about um, Nikki not clearing new body form? Uh, if he would have call, called me in the last three years, I would have told him that Nikki's not clearing anything. <laughs> I don't know what, what weird Kanye's been, what he's been up to, what he's been looking at, what he's been doing. But the last time I interviewed Nikki, in but so many words, she said, "Oh, I'm off that with Kanye." Mm-hmm. She that's, said that's she what, said some more too that's in that interview, it, yeah. but she was being cool. Right, she was being cool. But I like when she jumped, uh, stopped being cool. Yeah, she was being Say cool it. in her response today. She was like, "That train is." So, yeah, but I read through Nikki. I read through. I'm saying that's being cool. Being, that's being nice. She was being yes, cool, yes. but boy, I know what that meant, and it wasn't cool. <laughs> it wasn't cool at all. Let me shut up in case people out there don't know. But it wasn't cool. I don't know what what they beef is. Well, actually, I do because I interviewed her about. It. She said some of that shit. She just be speaking in cold. She's speaking in cold. She's off Kanye. He ain't getting no record clear. Well, a lot of people were. Hey, Kanye, fuck you, man. Fuck him for not putting the project out. <laughs> you, you actually thought that was going to come yeah. out? <laughs> no, I had forgot. But then when I saw him just on live, ranting and shut up, man. I didn't even go to I'm my done. Apple Music. I did yeah. Once the, the Backstreet Boys came out, I was like, hey, yeah. that's not. Yeah, it's not coming out. That's not clear. But he's got Yes Jules working on it now, so. <laughs> well, it'll have vibes. That's you true. guys are funny. <laughs> it'll have vibes. Yo, why would, I, why would anybody want to like be in that room? You know why. I don't. Yes, you do. I don't. It's, it's, why 20, would anybody, it's 2023, Why would anybody with their own sauce want to be there by him listening to any of that? I saw Cuddy there. For saucy or sauce? I didn't I t- see I'm going to tell you why. Soon. Because the average person can't get in that room. And yes, what, they can. No, they can't. Not the average person. Not just regular Joe Schmo. The chances of regular Joe Schmo getting in there is, is slim. So... It's the same thing about a New York listening party. It's, they don't even care. It's just more so to show that, hey, I'm here, you not. That's how they move. That's why everybody got a phone. That's why everybody records. That's why everybody has to that show. That nigga look like you cannot be around him unless you brought the whole ibuprofen bottle out. <laughs> <laughs> you got to have brought no, you that need, shit with you. you need Extra noise, strength. You need noise cancel joints around him because he don't stop. He's just going to keep talking and talking about... What the fucking Germans did to the Irish back Sounds like he just came home. The railroad. <laughs> yeah, like, dog, you blowing niggas. You blowing it in here. <laughs> Why would somebody just voluntarily join that? I cut that shit off from my phone. Like, I this nigga talk too much. <laughs> yeah. I'm telling you, bro. I only want to hear that shit when the music drop. Don't hold up the music and then give me all these fucking soliloquies. I ain't even cool. click that shit. When like, oh, he's loud. Yeah. The album dropping or no. I don't need to hear any rant from him. I mean, you know, I know he's passionate about whatever he feels and thinks and speaks on. Cool. 
I am a fan of Kanye the artist, and that's all I care about. Drop the music. If it don't drop, fine. Nicki shot at Envy, too. Oh, yeah? yeah. I didn't see that. I didn't see that. Shot at Envy. Y'all don't. Well, y'all yeah. are great at your jobs. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What'd she say? I ain't reading that shit. Oh. She said something about Envy. Envy said, uh, remember when Envy uh, called for me to be blackballed on the air? He said it with so much confidence. The arrogance to think that that type of behavior is okay from a DJ. God is going to show y'all that y'all are not God one by one. Total shit. That's what she said in so many words. Eesh. And Envy mm -hmm. did reply to it uh, this morning on radio. I don't remember what he said, but... Mm. Salute. I like all the spice. I me do. Me too. It makes things interesting. I do. I do. This must be me. I don't know. Oh, come on. I don't care for none of that shit, Joe. Listen, if they didn't do it all, we'd get his fucking Christmas albums, man. <laughs> come we on. ain't got no music anyway. We get Christmas. And we got all the spice. We still ain't got no music. We'd get Christmas albums and Blueface saying that it ain't his kid. Damn. Like I'm 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 cool. Come on. Flood my flood my timeline with something. Some petty beef. Anything, mm. please. From ten years ago. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, we still on Nikki, she got a, a beef with Billboard now. She does. Mm. They said that they're not counting some of her uh, sales because, because she gave away money or she, something, right? And yeah, gave away money and well, no, no. They were saying because she was asking fans to post the, the proof of purchase. Proof of purchase. What's wrong with that? I but have there was no a, wasn't idea. there a whole contest going on where you it required a proof of purchase of the album to be able to participate in the contest. Yes. And because of that, they're saying that they're going to discount some sales. I'm confused. And what she did to, to back up her argument, she was like, well, it's all right when she, she put the screenshot up of what um, Meg and then were giving out mm -hmm. cash app mm -hmm. for people to buy the album. Right. She's like, that was fine. I'm asking after purchase to show us proof of purchase. That's it. And we can't do this when they're actually giving you money to buy the album. These games are weird. It's, game, yeah. it's, it's, it's disgusting, bro. It's really weird. I'm, I'm lost and confused. What it look like is once you on the other side of whoever it is, they're going to find their way to fuck you. Could be. I need to hear Billboard's side. Because Billboard, is it's, what it sounds like is they're citing a violation in rules. What it sounds like and, is, and Nikki, you're not playing along with our game, whatever game it is, and we'll stack the deck against you. That's what it sounds like. And that's what it sounded like against her for a while. And that's what she's constantly been speaking out about even from the last two albums, is like, yo, I'm fighting against these big machines and these big corporations. I'm fighting a different fight. They are stacked. They are against me. I got to do this a different way. Is she in a bundle program or not? I believe she is in a bundle program because they, oh, they were selling vinyl, I know, way before the album dropped. They were like, I think Walmart and everybody had vinyl available for purchase, like a pre-order almost, before okay. the album dropped. I don't know if that considers bundle. Uh, right, I think I see what the problem is. And I ain't saying it. Leave me, leave me out of it. But I see what the problem is. You see is. it? From this information, unless mm -hmm. there's something I'm missing, yeah. If you're, running a, if you're running bundles and reporting your own numbers and you're not in the bundle program, then we're going to stop it. Mm. Oh, yeah. The bundle program. It's oh. a bundle program. You can't just... Because you can't legitimize the... No. Billboard or whoever runs that shit has to <clears throat> approve how you're going about your bundle program. Fuck mm -hmm. that. The bundle program is we got to get paid. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's what it really... That's the real yes, bundle that's program. The yes, bundle. Yes. That's the real bundle program. What's our slice? Yes. We exactly. got to get paid. You can't just sell your own shit. No, no, no. It has to go through here where we get a cut. Mm -hmm. And they did... I, I want to say without fact checking that they did something like this with Travis too. Where they was like, up after a while, they there stopped counting the sales that he was delivering from his website off the bundles. Mm. And he was in the bundle program. Mm. But uh, 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 what you're doing over there, it doesn't comply with our rules. We ain't getting our cut. That ain't the right t-shirt. It ain't the right. So, That's no, crazy. we're not counting that shit. That shit is and crazy. it's Billboard. So what is any, any of us going to do to Billboard? Well, you see what I did. I stopped. <laughs> but what <laughs> is wish, anybody else going to do I wish. Billboard? I don't know. Like, I just wish... People kind of took. I don't know where it went where we let Billboard determine if your album is good or a success or like it's so much stock in just Billboard number, right. which is kind of what Hove has been saying for the longest. Like y'all are still looking at Billboard numbers. Fuck that. 
It's stupid. Well, it's a trick. It, it is. is, it is it's literally it's a, a smoke and mirrors trick. It's but, sleight of hand. Hey, look over here while you don't see what we're robbing you, but we want you to pay attention to this number actually here. actually buying that their don't own shit. albums to push up Billboard. Like, yeah. it's the most ass backwards. But the music business is smoke and mirrors. True. A lot of selling hope. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's a lot of... A lot of selling the look. That too. Yeah, so now you know why that Billboard shit is so important. The optic. The optic of it and what a number one album could do. What a top five album could do for your career. Listen, man, good luck to anybody playing the game out yeah, there. Word. Yeah, Good that's, luck that's, to that's anybody the game, playing the game out there. This shit is rough. Now it's a good time to play that clip you was playing earlier, actually. Oh, shit. It's, yeah, a, it's, it's, a, it's a cold game out there. Uh, I just heard Kirk Franklin talking about when he signed his first deal in 92 or 93, he uh, unknowingly signed over 100% of his publishing because he didn't know better and he didn't Ooh. have an entertainment lawyer. He had like a real estate lawyer or some shit. He didn't even know there were different types of lawyers. Right. Yeah. Cold, cold game. Don't think that all these years have passed since since uh, that 20 years have passed and the record labels and the people that run this shit haven't updated the tricks. Oh, yeah. Like when we was out, we had to deal with the 360 and they was gangster and niggas. They was coming to niggas. Yo, get down or lay down. You in this 360 or you'll get no support and we dropping you from the label. Mm-hmm. Now they have advanced all of the tricks. They own Spotify in part. <laughs> the biggest streamer that exists that doesn't pay anybody. That generates How about however that? many millions of dollars a day and somehow no one gets really Well, anybody. why am I going to pay a people that seem happy to just post how many plays they got? Right. They That's seem really, really excited about that. Super so I would not pay them. Sick. Go ahead. It's, a, it's a little lengthy. A little lengthy, minutes. but you'll see where he's going. Yeah, like says who and why is it a contest? Can't it just be this is awesome shit? Here's some different well, awesome that, that's shit. Why we didn't, that's yeah. why we didn't bundle. That was the whole motivation behind this record. Was like, it was to not, um, not partake in the current bullshit in the music industry. Which is, so check this out. Do you mind if I explain it? Please do. Please, okay. Please, please, please explain please. it. Please explain it. We had a conversation with our manager um, about this record, right? You know, release. We had, and it, like, it went from everything like we have family. We don't really want to be on the road for a hundred days this year. We don't necessarily want to do anything. We don't. We don't want to do anything. We're not excited about. You know, so it came down to the promotion and stuff. And it was basically like we want to get in front of people and play our songs and have fun. You know, and uh, and the dream. The conversation yeah. came up. That's with what all artists say. Album, That's like, how it started. Yeah. Um, Warner Brothers was interested if we wanted to bundle it, Uh-oh. which is when you include the record like with a ticket, right? And a lot of people have been doing it. And it's more than a ticket. You buy a t-shirt and you get a record, and it's a t-shirt. digital download there you go. link. Important digital download um, And I was like, well, how does that work? And I'm like, well, um, you, uh, you would give $5 from each ticket back to Warner Brothers, and then you would get a record sale. And I was like, that doesn't make, that doesn't make any sense. To, to me and to Dan, and they're like, yeah, I well, you would, you, it's the only way you're gonna get a number one record. So if you want a number one record, you got to do that. And I was like, well, I was like, well, um, so it's one to one. Like we give five bucks back, and then we get a royalty, and we get a ticket sale. And like, no, you don't get a royalty, and you only get a tick, you only get an album ca- sale count if they click the link, no, and they have like we have a fifty percent click through. So, in other words, we would pay ten dollars per sale on Nielsen SoundScan. Cut it off. Bye. That's it. That's it. Yeah. Much. That's it. That is disgusting. Hopefully, that didn't sound like some foreign language to y'all out there. It but probably did. To but those of you that did understand that, the game is the game, and it's a cold one. Who was that? That was uh, Black Keys and Joe Rogan. Oh, okay. I think I saw that interview. And we, yeah, I saw it too. Yeah. We are going to stay here. Breaking news hot off the press. Cardi B went live to kick her husband's back in. Oh, boy. Oh, oh this is great. We lit tonight. Because <laughs> you will fucking talk to a nigga and a motherfucker will play in your fucking face. Oh, let me play in my your drop fucking over face this. over and over and over and Ooh. over and over again. Ooh. And she'll be like, watch. Watch what I'm about to do. Watch what I'm about to say. And it's so fucking sad that a nigga like you. Yo, this motherfucker really likes to play games with me when I'm at my most vulnerable time. When, I, when I'm not the most confident, well, that's the best time they like to, like to play games with me because he knows <laughs> you get it I'm not an easy girl. He, he knows 
Yesterday, I could have been out. I could have been chilling. I could have been this and that. He knows I'm in my house. He knows oh, that word. I'm chilling. He knows I'm not doing the most. That's who you And I've really been to. sparing you. <laughs> I've really been sparing you. You've been fucking feeling yourself, you bitch ass nigga, because of your bitch ass album and shit. Oh my you've God. really been fucking doing me dirty after so many fucking years that oh, I'm motherfucking oh, up oh, there. Oh, shit, oh, oh. She took it up. Not even a fucking bitch. Oh, that I got this is the problem with Spanish girls. Ass. Oh, see, Spanish. And it's so crazy. I got to go to the fucking internet. Oh, God. Whenever I fuck, I tell you something. All right. Yep. That was that was oh, what we got. Okay. <laughs> yep. There yep. is a lot to unpack here. Oh, I would love to hear from Ish on this Ooh. topic. <laughs> that what he call him. <laughs> is laid up with some shit in his ass. Oh, come on. With his legs up in the air like Uncle Luke. <laughs> it's like two oh, weeks in a row they got him Like a Luke man. show. Oh, my God. Fucking Ish. My man. Ish. And he ain't even got no hair down there, so it ain't oh even warm God. where. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga shit is freezing. <laughs> yeah, oh. poor Ish. Uh, a lot to unpack here. A lot to unpack here. And this is the problem with artist to artist relationships. This is the problem with artists dating artists. Cardi, I don't a track list came out earlier this week. I don't I know if it's it real. Fake. I don't know if I it's think, fake. It's it might have been fake. I'm assuming it's fake, mm -hmm. but I don't care. I'm going with my thought process, which is more fun than real life. Mm -hmm. uh, and on that fake track list was a track featuring offset. Take me off. If we're in a relationship and we break up, take me off. Take me off the shit. I don't care if you was on my album. I don't care. We was together. And you kill, you kill my album too. Thank you. Yes. For signing off. And you smoked my shit. And I needed that. It gave me the boost. Plus my Don single with my Michael Jackson shit. I'm dancing now in the TikTok shit. You was at the TikTok shit. You see me dancing. <laughs> Take me off your project. Now, might have been fake, so we'll leave it alone. Maybe offsets down the album. Mm. But you're not going to argue with me over my cheating or my infidelity and then put me on your album. You're not. Now, she said he's been feeling himself since his album came out. I think that's the other problem with artist-to-artist -artist relationships. Uh -huh. That is when you're supposed to feel yourself. Absolutely. Yeah. As an artist, that's when you feel your best. Yeah. You, and, and the album was received well. It, it great. Did, it did great. Like, great reception. Yeah. You got me, got me working. Ooh, I know it's Not just working. that. Hold up. Not just you that, you though. You on purpose. My album did great when I was kind of being counted Count out. Counted out. Because I left the camp, you know, I left the group. I'm Rest in peace, take off. Just lost take my off. man. Just lost my mans. I'm not over there at QC no more. None of that beef with them. Quavo put some heat out. They thought I couldn't match. They thought I couldn't oh, match nah, that I Quavo it. heat. I, I might feel myself a little bit. I'm feeling I'm myself, feel myself walking around the house. I don't feel like that should be an indictment to my partner. I might feel I myself either. a little bit. But that is an indictment to your partner when your partner's hotter than you. Mm. See, and that's the problem. It's tricky. When your partner is bigger than you, respectfully, Offset, because I don't even like to talk about niggas' marriages. I'm talking about that, yeah. the artist shit, artist. Uh, mm -hmm. the artist part of this. You can't walk around the house like that and your girl bigger than you. That's tough. That's a tough situation. She should understand, though. Yeah. Yeah. What, happens uh, when they, what happens when they both had to shower around the same time she went in first? You know girls take the longer shower. Yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure they have in a rush. Stop I'm gonna, it. See, now I'm rush. I got to get so... I, I knew somebody like you was going to say that. What? Well, that's Cap. What'd you say, Parks? I said, I'm sure they have two showers. I'm sure they have seven showers. Uh -huh. 15. What the fuck do that have to do <laughs> with the man wanting to use his favorite shower in the house <laughs> <and> she in <laughs> while she in there? Yeah. God, what do they have to do with that? Nothing. It's. I got other showers too when Shorty is in there. And you can't even say, yo, could you hurry go, it up a yeah, little you, bit? You, you, I uh, still uh, go in there and start shaping up my beard or some shit. I start, hey, 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 big dog, get your hefty ass out the fucking shower. It's my skinny turn. <laughs> and I ain't even really skinny, but all them crevices, they in there picking up their whole thick ass, thick ass titties, mad hair. Yo, hey, dog. Do that shit at the fire hydrant. Yo. Yo. <laughs> Yo. I'm talking shit. I'm talking shit. Talking of course shit. I'm talking shit because it's my job as an entertainer. Of course. <laughs> but you and, can't do that. And it's if album, my girl, it's album release, if I my girl be somewhere. Went, if my girl ever on, went man. diamond, you can't do that no more. Nah, nah. That's her shower. You know yeah. what's crazy? You just use it sometimes. You can't do it. Mm -mm. You cannot do it. You can't. If my girl half of the down payment was a little more than mine <laughs> on, on this mansion, <laughs> guess what? Hold up. I got to go to the bath, the shower I don't like in the house. 
yo, if, if my girl is the reason I was able to get out from under the other situation. That part too. <laughs> like, so imagine Cardi's POV, which is like, you motherfucker. The audacity. <laughs> Wait, I was there this whole time and you waited till you got piping scorching hot to start showing your ass to me? Oh, yeah, nah. Nah. And I got a project coming, so you know I ain't been feeling the greatest. My op just sold records. My op is out here living life, selling records, Doing good. going live. Pissing off out here. Now, yeah, I don't want my op going live. Shit looking good over there. No, I got to take that out on somebody. I got to take that out on somebody. Hey, to hell with toxic relationships. But that part needs to stay when the day just beat your ass and you come home, your partner in here just doing some shit oblivious to how tough it's been. Dump it on them. <laughs> <laughs> so is, he, is she just... Dump it on them. Is she justified in you her... You mute. I want to dump it on you. Yeah, I know you <laughs> fucking do. I want to <laughs> dump on you right now. <laughs> but is dump she, it on your partner your co-host, your beautiful co-host. <laughs> is she justified in her rant right now? Because I don't believe for a single second that she ever made him feel like he was less than or he was, you know, the, the whatever. I don't think that that's yeah, the dynamic comes. in the house. I think that Cardi was a wildly supportive and they were not boyfriend and girlfriend. They were married. True. I think she was a wildly supportive partner, mate, and wife to him. I, I think so. So, I so she speak, she's crying. She's speaking yeah. from like a, a real sense of betrayal. But Spanish women, when they yell yeah. past a certain point, you, ain't never dated, a, you never dated a Spanish girl. Yeah. Yeah. You're right. Yeah. I have not dated a Spanish girl. <laughs> I'm, I'm that is not in my I'm sure that she. I'm sure all that shit you just said is true. Yeah. And with it being true, I'm positive that he has had to be there for her 80% more just because of her temperament. Agreed, yeah. She's sensitive. She be reading shit. And let me say, I don't like that shit that Blueface did. Blueface started this. Blueface yeah. did this. I just, I don't, yeah. I'm, 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 I'm Blueface and Krishan, you to, know that's out of my, out of that's my, out of my wheelhouse. I shit. don't even talk about that shit. I try not to pay attention to that shit. Hey, prayer, prayers for all, all parties Everybody. involved. But just for just for the sake of understanding what he's talking about, Blueface basically accused Offset and Krishan of fucking, he basically said the exact place and time that it yep. happened. He put a date oh, on Oh, I was going to put way more sauce on it. You don't tell my shit no more. <laughs> no, for real. No. On an Instagram, on a Twitter rant. Yeah. Yo, oh, my girl just fucked, my girl just fucked Offset three weeks ago. Yo, as the men out there, I'm talking to the men out there. Mm -hmm. Some of us have been through it. It don't have to be true. But the mere fact of somebody saying something, and you know that most of our girls don't deal well with strangers saying things that have no real effect on things. <laughs> they don't. Actually, most of our girls out there love when a stranger just volunteers some Say shit. Some bullshit. They might not have known. They want to get the nigga number. <laughs> they yeah, want to talk. They want to. Blueface continued. Oh, man. He said, oh, you saying I'm lying? Blueface moms came in. My, one thing my son don't do is lie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> chill, chill. We can't get too mad. Cause some of y'all moms, moms be holding it. Uh, man, this shit is a mess out here in the street. It is. Yo, y'all mm -hmm. think 2023 fourth quarter been wild? Wait till next year. Oh no, no, no. Wait till 2024. It's, 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 it's going down. But anyway, one thing my baby don't do. He's not. He does not lie. Mm, sure. Blueface, hell, y'all think I'm lying? It was this date and this time when he was supposed to be doing this. Yep. Yikes. See, I hate that some of you niggas out there don't have y'all people in check, so you got to drag some nigga down with you. Yeah. Offset has been chilling, and I know that he's been chilling because he got caught too many times. Mm -hmm. So he don't have no more get-out-of-jail-free cards. Mm -hmm. The niggas out there, some of us have been there. You're right. You got to be on your best behavior even when you're not on your best behavior. You taking an extra precaution to make sure. Your superstar wife don't know that you fucking the hood rat. And here comes some nigga that you, a variable that you just could not see. And this is the problem with fucking girls that got a, a crazy, st stupid nigga that love them somewhere. They gonna snitch, be, be emotional about it. And as soon as Blueface did all that, I said, I know that Cardi is in this nigga's face, Matt, in her phone matching dates, texts, oh, yeah. Yeah, times. She, she wouldn't compare shit up right away. We going through it. Yo, you told me you was at this it's studio. Mm -hmm. I knew that. That'd be the other thing. Oh, yeah. So It'd be I, a girl I might have even said something about before. You told me it was nothing. Mm -hmm. And it's this little bitch. Oh, that 
And I asked you, and it's this little bitch that I wait you not wait you treat me like this and fucking her you can't embarrass your girl like that because that's when your girl get on live and do this yeah well it's also I wanted to say Cardi is wrong for getting on live and doing this because you shouldn't do this she shouldn't do that though but this is when your girl does this she's 100% gonna do it oh yeah in that instance right there oh yeah no I call I call my my girl had a photo shoot when we broke up one time and went live (laughs) Guess who was in the live? <laughs> Joe Budden. Chilling. <laughs> <laughs> we need to find a way for us to sneak into the live without our girl seeing that we in the live. It pop up. Your stupid ass nigga here watching. Right here. He's here. Your stupid ass nigga, the first one here watching. Boy, she was telling this stranger nigga, all oh, my business. <laughs> oh, oh, shit. shit. After talking to him, I was like, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, all, I'm just watching like, word. That's how you going to do it. But there's nothing you could do. And you can't do shit. But there's shit. nothing you could do. You can't do it. Right. You Everything. fucked up too much. Yep. Mm-hmm. You fucked it up gotta, too much. You got to eat that. So now your girl need to vent to anybody that got ears. This Insta Live is indicative of that. Offset, Cardi, I love y'all, and I hope that y'all make y'all way through this. You can't do this after you already went on stage to get your girl back. You interrupted the show. He fucked the I show remember that. With, with the flowers. The girls and, tried to say that that was abusive and manipulative, they too. They did. They did. <laughs> it worked, though. That's why, it, that's why it's only, that's why it's only it, manipulative if, if it works. Yeah. If it doesn't work. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like, if your girl spots the manipulation, then you lost. Yeah. She but if it works, what happens. that's what I told Ice and Ish. The art is in getting away with it. That's where the art is. Mm. Mm. There was rumors that this whole breakup shit was just to take yeah. the spotlight off Nikki for a minute. I do think it's it timely. Was. I do think it's timely. Mm. But the other report was that this is not the first time that they've broken up, that oh, they've been living no, separately. See, that's, some, that's some girly report shit. Mm. We don't know where that comes from or how substantial that is. That's just somebody saying that. To How get substantial some is that? What Parks just this said. This was just speculation. For Thank fans. you. Thank you. Which part? The the fact the, the, that the, this all happened the, to pop up around Nikki's release to potentially take the uh, wind out the of her shine. sails. Yeah. Yeah. That's some valid speculation. <laughs> That's valid speculation. It's twenty twenty three. People. The do story right that. before this was how uh, how. How uh, this industry is and how foul it could be and some of the tricks people play. Yeah, that was yeah. the story right well, the before reason, this. Well, I know, but the reason why what I just said relates to what Parks just said is because people had the reaction. They were like, oh, this is Cap because Nikki's album's coming out and you want to take the shine away from her. Mm. So then the next thing that came out was, no, this has been an ongoing thing. They've been separate. They've been living separate lives to, make, to justify that this is not just a ploy. That right. was why it but came that, out. That, it, what, that would actually make it more of a ploy to me. Mm-hmm. If we've been separated, living separate lives. Why is it now just coming why out? Why is it news yeah. now? Why is it now? A, why are we now going public and making this a thing? Mm-hmm. Agreed. So, yeah, that, that would actually make me more think that this would be a ploy. It is timely. I'm not saying it's, I'm not, it's mm-hmm. purposeful, mm-hmm. but it is timely. She does have a project coming at some point. And it's not a record. Yeah, I don't know. Well, I'm not in the position to say what it is, but this does sound like I know when I some see real the, foul shit to the Spanish girl. I was just getting ready to say when I see that <laughs> when they yell past that certain point and it turns into that yell cry combo, the ugly one. Yeah. That, that don't yeah. really be fake. When yeah, that that'd be ugly. That yeah, they be dead ass. Yeah, that don't be fake when they do that. Why do they do that shit, man? I'm not. I'm, I'm not. Cry as... cool, yo. <laughs> I hate when they make the ugly cry because now you can't even really respond. You got to wait for that shit to like pass. Then that gets awkward and uncomfortable. You, you make, make fun you... of the way I cry, and I am like a silent crier. Melissa, you are a uh... dramatic crier that cries hey, over everything that, that, in the universe. And you make dramatic exit when you cry. Yeah, you, yeah. you, don't just, you do all you, of the girly you, damsel you and distress bullshit you, that you, men hate. You're complaining about her going, you know, off. You're no, no, complaining. no, 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 We're not we, complaining which about one, that. Which, which kind of crying do you don't, prefer? Don't, don't fuck our point up. We totally understood why she went off. Yeah, we're not complaining. I'm not complaining about her crying. We're just saying when you see that, that's... If I if I did think this whole thing was fake, roll out, whatever, once I saw that, Oh, no, it would change say. your opinion. Yes, that's what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. You don't think that you're a dramatic crier? No, I think I'm a very graceful crier. Uh, where is that delusion uh, board? <laughs> where, <laughs> start it right that, fucking where, now. Where, you can start no, it right you, now. You started it. I'm adding to it. <laughs> yes, Mel, you are a dramatic, dramatic 
fryer. I, I don't deal well, well with I rock those with you. fryers. I rock, you I know, know I rock you with you. You mm-hmm. know, you, you definitely are. You definitely are. I have instances okay. that like came you, right to mind. Yeah, you win the cry, like the examples. Potter Cry Award of the year. I don't yeah. think there's another Potter that's cried more than you this no, year. No, there was one time, I'm not going to say the name of the person that was involved. You yelled out. You were sitting here. You were the only person on the couches. Like, we didn't even start recording or anything yet. Everybody was in the kitchen. And you said, I'm triggered! And stormed up, <laughs> crying. Yeah, <laughs> and ran in there. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. All right, then. Fuck you, Ice. <laughs> but, you do, but yeah, that's you true. You do shit like that. Like I'm in touch with my fucking emotions. I know y'all don't know what the fuck that looks no, no, no. like, I'm, but I'm that's what emotional, that looks like. You do, that, emotional trauma, you do shit like that with no, it's not another girl at work. <laughs> and then you got the nerve to post them fucking memes. Oh, I just like to work with. Oh, I could have killed it. Oh, I could have. Oh, I was cracking up at that. I wasn't I cracking up at all. I knew what she was doing. I had smoke. I knew they had the fuming. <laughs> coming from my head. <laughs> oh, I said Bell weaponized them all I with that, that one. Shirt. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. Okay, that was, that was the battle cry right there. She's good. No, that was the horn. They all was ready to go. Yeah, mm-hmm. what a way, to, what a way to throw your bros <laughs> under the bus. Word, quick. Hot after they defend you. Anywho, <laughs> then she calls out. Holy shit! That, that was, oh god, <laughs> yo, you got it. You give me a pound. Give me a pound. Give me a pound. Yo. Oh boy, if I told you what that weekend was like. Oh, I got some tea for you too. Oh, I got some tea. You can't have tea for me. I got tea. Smoking, How hot piping tea? hot tea. You How are- many degrees? 175 or, That's two, or two, 200. Yeah, 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 this is right. Meaning you, can't, you cannot even blow on it because it's 212 where it, it boils you, 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 you gotta let it you gotta let the cover off and just let it you know oh, shit. first of all doing, doing that make me think we got video of my girl cheating so <laughs> oh shit when you, no no when no, you no, paint, no no when you paint no it like god, that. no no if it's god, not that then no, it ain't sorry, that hot no, yeah it no. ain't the hottest that's some, that's some lukewarm okay, tea at that point yeah, yeah. the fuck no. alright no. okay, I'll, no. I'll take some tea I guess I bet you this is not the hottest of teas <laughs> I can't wait to hear it though. <laughs> uh, what else? What else? Oh, what else? Uh, John ja Moran. Oh no, not no, no, John no, no, Moran. Because no, no. uh, we were talking about you know Meg and I mean sorry Cardi and Offset, the Instagram thing. I was saying, did y'all see um, Meg reply to Party? Yeah, uh, yeah. I think yeah. everybody did. Yeah. Okay. I have a question, and I'm gonna ask you. Okay. Was that gaslighting? Which part? Who? Meg. How do oh. you figure? <laughs> she put the song out uh-huh. with a line in the song uh-huh. right? that said nobody's oh, name. Oh, oh, oh. Go me, ahead. Mm-hmm. You ask me how, so I'm going to explain <laughs> you how. Mm-hmm. She put the song out mm-hmm. you with the line. Mm-hmm. She's right? gaslight nice. Yeah. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> he replies to that. Mm-hmm. Well, no, no, before he replies, he gets killed immediately okay. on the internet, right? Facts. Okay. Killed. Mm-hmm. Comments, everything. Mm-hmm. He replies via record. Mm-hmm. That went on for well, a week, two weeks probably. Mm-hmm. And now you come out and say, oh, that wasn't even about you. Well, she really couldn't get away with saying that because she didn't put a name on that bullet. If that were the case. she once, allowed. Well, it's, everybody had their own opinions, which they're going to have their own opinions. I mean, people have opinions. I've seen no uh, other opinion of it being any other guy at the party. Oh, I've seen oh. no opinion stating, hey, this could be that other guy. But my question, just my thing is, if, it, if it's <laughs> on a plot. <laughs> that's a it, gaslighting face. Yo, this, this is all gaslighting. <laughs> oh, if it nice. doesn't apply to him, mm-hmm. and you know that, and you see everybody attacking him before he says a thing. You can't say, well, that's not, I wasn't, I wasn't talking about him? As far as I know, he actually did make comments about her prior to the song coming out and talked about, you know, the demise of their relationship and the re- and his reasons when? behind the demise of the relationship. Nah, he was silent as He well. was silent. The yeah, oh, only thing happened. we ever saw was him pop out with his new girl. Yeah. He never said a word. Until the song. Until the song. His reaction was the, the, the record, and then he went on a press run. Mm-hmm. Okay. We I might. I'm, listen, listen, listen. I might have the order mixed yeah. up just is, because up. you know I don't. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. I'll you might take have it. Mis- mis- misremember. Yeah. yeah. I mean, you know. But I, I just want to know: is that is that a case of gaslighting? gaslighting. Yeah. <laughs> Mel. So now that you got the order correct, is yeah. that a case of gaslighting? No, because oh, she never shit. said his name. 
She never said. She never. She never said his name. Now you got it, big dog. Now you You got got it already. We gave it to you. She put a little more fuel in that light. (laughs) (laughs) She saw that shit on fire. Because you guys would use the. You you guys would. Because if it was in the reverse, you guys would say the same thing. You guys would say he never said her name. He could be talking about anybody. Okay. She ain't the first bitch that he fucked. If it were in the reverse, what would you say when we said that? Well, it, no, you, no, no, come on, it's, it's right there at the tip of your tongue. Come on, starts with G. It's right there at the tip of your tongue. I'd you can pro- say it. I'd probably say, well, everybody has assumes that it is about her, but then you guys would stop me and say, but there's not a name on the bullet, so it's it could be so, anybody. And then, and then, Question and if we said be that, posed, mm-hmm. you and then, would and call then I'd, that. I'd yeah, have, I'd have like, to shut the fuck up. Good. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Nope, nope, I'm not going to do it. Okay. I am right. not going to do it. Sorry. Respect. Okay. Yo, mm-hmm. it is so tough being a male dominant pod, working with a single woman, <laughs> like one woman. It is, it is tough. Mm. It's mm. A, that shit is. <laughs> she did. She gaslit the shit out. She, but it's she, fine. She, we can move she, on. We don't have to argue she, about yeah, that we part. Gotta, yeah. uh, mm-hmm. What do we think about the, the gaslighting job? It's going to always work because she's so much more p- bigger than he is. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And his press run looked too much like a press run. Yeah. It didn't look cool. Yeah. yeah. It looked like he popped up to anybody Everywhere. that had a microphone. Mm-hmm. We know yep. that he reached out to us. I was down to, to do that as well. Not now that you done went and yeah, did yeah, everything yeah. in the world. Was, right. Now it's over. Yes. But And for the story that you're telling out there, it's not press run worthy like that. All you're saying is I cheated, but she cheated first. Or what's cheating? Receiving inappropriate text to the phone, yada, yada, yada. Like, you're doing all of that stuff. We as niggas and heard it all before. Like, we don't. I thought you was coming to spill the tea. Yeah. I mean, he spilled the tea in a song. Yeah. I know. I, would, so he, I thought that, he was going to keep that energy, but. He spilled it. Ain't nothing to spill no more. And, you know, and, I, talk about and no I saw more. his reply to her reply. You know, they look like they're still in love. <laughs> they look like they ain't over it yet, both of them. See, that's oh, what a I, thousand that, percent. That, that was the question I was going to ask. How do you, with, how, if you, Mel. Yeah. I love having a woman here sometimes. Okay. Me too. Sometimes. Sometimes. Go sometimes. ahead. Mm-hmm. As if you're the new girl, mm-hmm. how do you feel? I hate all of this. With I fucking hate all yeah, of this. Okay. If I'm the new girl yeah. and I'm watching you two, you know, spill all the bullshit that went on, the good, bad, the ugly, I'm sitting here feeling like a fucking dick. I'm I like like, come on, man. I'm watching you talk endlessly about your ex and it's your famous ex and it's your stunningly beautiful ex and talent. And I'm feeling like a fucking asshole. You know, okay. it's, un- it's uncomfortable. That's and that's just my perception. I don't know uh, how she's feeling no, no, about no, this. Just, but, I, that's why I asked it yeah. for you. Not that's why we, it sucks to ask in Mel anything because Mel is Mel and Mel's experience is so different from just like a normal girl's She experience. might be loving this. On the flip side, let me uh, let me yeah. provide you with a different POV. Yeah, I've been somewhere in this ballpark too. Mm. If a woman likes you, we're acting under the guise that you like this new guy a lot, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and you see him having some trouble getting over a recent breakup. Mm-hmm. Sometimes you might urge that man to do whatever you feel you need to do to get this out of your system so we can proceed. If that is true. If that's you. Venting in a song, baby, do it. If you feel like you need to have one last talk because you got the thing, you can do that. But Mm -hmm. I can't be here and watch you this way for a certain amount of time. Mm -hmm. What do you think of that? From that perspective, I completely agree with that. I'm speaking from the perspective of somebody who has had a spotlight on me, who's been visible and probably has like a different level of ego related to... um, my experiences and the public perception of who they believe me to be and who and, and the expectations of who I'm supposed to be with and how they're supposed to treat me and all that stuff is going to factor in. But if I'm that girl where I don't have all that extra baggage, I'll sure I'll Which, be a fucking battery in your back. And this is why men like women in that age bracket, because they don't have all of that ex- experience and baggage. Mm-hmm. Right. Like that girl looks in heaven anytime her and parties together. Mm hmm. She looks like she is happier than ever. And this nigga right hits for girls? Yeah. 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 Well, I mean, shit, if you look at Meg during the time which that she was with Party, she looked ha- she looked she happy as fuck. She did. She looked ridiculously happy. They she looked did. extremely happy together. So Well, I, that's that's well, that's the other thing that we don't want to discount. 
yeah, we, I don't, we I, know his ability to show up for somebody with yes. the world on their shoulders yes. and the results of it because she did yes. seemingly appear to be okay. Yes, and I can't take that away from him because that, in fact, is what how it appeared to yeah. be, is that she had uh, you know, the world on her shoulders mm -hmm. and that he showed up for her and was supportive of her and they, they looked like they were in love with each other and, you know, it, was a, it, was, it looked like a great situation. I just kind of, like, had an issue with the proportional, like the proportion of his response to her insinuation on a song. You know what I mean? It's he's a rapper. I get. Yeah. And yeah, she but, wasn't slick about it. But the whole talking. She wasn't about, slick. But the whole talking. She, yeah, but you know what you were doing. But my son, she my, know what she was doing, you know and she wasn't doing. slick about and it, it. And it worked. Yeah, it what worked. she was doing worked. It worked. You know why? Because that's the line of the song that everybody ran into. It is. Trust me when I say I know everything about having a line in a song about you being the only thing that people <laughs> fucking remember. I know a little something about yeah, that. Yeah, but you don't know about it being com coming from somebody that you was in love with. Yeah. You don't that know. That is definitely you don't true. Know I didn't know that. It's nigga a whole from different layer when, different. when I was just riding with I you do, side I, by side. It was me and you versus the world. And you turned around and did that. It's true. It's the but, same thing Cardi just said offset. Yes. But it's true. But you also have to, you can't, you can't, you can't penalize somebody for how they process, how they, how they feel about how you did them dirty. You know what I'm saying? Like that was her reaction to feeling betrayal. You know? Okay. So stop, hold on, stop. hold on. Wait, no, 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 but it no, wasn't no, no, about no, no, him. Mm? Ooh. <laughs> it wasn't about him though. You got me. Fuck you, Parks. But I was getting, well, look, I that's was, if the that's if that's girl. if. Okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. More gas, more no, gas. That's, yeah, if, the that's, him. Right that's look, if the line is about Let's him. That's if the line is about him. Let's say the line is about him. Okay, okay. let's operate under that thinking right. that the, the line is about him because that's what we're doing. We have been, but you just said you can't penalize somebody for reacting to that betrayal, right? You don't think he felt betrayal? That's what we were talking about. I was the one holding you down, me. Mm -hmm. When it was the world against you, your entire world went upside down. It was only me here for you. Mm -hmm. You went and did this to me on a song. You Deeper got, than you that. He said, home. I asked you about all I, of these men. And you these told are conversations me no. I asked you about. I looked you in your eyes and asked you about and you told me no. Like you lied to me. I found out when the rest of the world found out. And you put this song out on my daughter's birthday knowing it was my daughter's birthday. It just looked so... so now, okay, it looked I didn't hurt, get that part. It looks hurtful so, all mm -hmm. around the yes. board. So now, there is... <laughs> Hurt and betrayal mm -hmm. that he could feel, which would cause him to respond the way he did. Mm -hmm. What do you say to that? I think it's an uncomfortable conversation that not very many people, especially women, will be will want to be honest about when it comes to your nigga asking about your fucking body count. You know what I'm saying? Because women are just so used to being judged on that. Up, 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 up. I'm not letting you do that woman bullshit. Why? Right why? I'm why not letting her do it. And why, then ask I'm not letting, why isn't I'm this not, a factor? I'm not letting her do it because that a body count conversation is one thing, and you are well within your right. You know how we all feel about those. Mm -hmm. That's corny. If I'm actively beefing with men, and they are returning fire in a way that looks like. They, they, you might, they something know something there that they, yeah. And I I'm come to you, you and say, yo, you fuck with this nigga? Have you ever a fucked crazy. him? Have oh, you ever him? fucked him? Have you ever him. fucked him? That is not a body count conversation. No. Okay, so let me That's, ask. I got smoke with these niggas and they look at they me talking They firing on me. Way. It's a nigga talking about you gonna fuck me up when I go backstage at the festival. Is that, is this, are you, are you putting special sauce on this? Or no, is this, an that, this happened. That happened. That okay. happened. Okay, okay. These are the things that make somebody go. It's not weird. It's not weird. It's common. These are the things that make men say, hey, hey yo, did you, you fuck, fuck him? Nigga? Cause he's acting, Especially he's acting in weird. entertainment. Especially in entertainment. You know what? Let me tell you something. I will say this. From, from recent fucking experiences, what I have come to really realize is that women truly do not understand how you guys function and relate or not relate to each other. We don't get it. Like there's a, there's just a, there's just like a, 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 a lack of understanding because we're not men. There is nothing and to you understand. you put it on your moms that But you there is nothing to understand when the man is that direct. Hey, as a man. No, she understood. As a man, the same way y'all have y'all shit, woman to woman, y'all have y'all woman shit that we just have to understand yep. that. 
Yo, y'all don't, you don't get shit, it. We ain't gonna I can get tell it. the way she Men moving. Have you don't it get it too. because I'm a woman. So if your male intuition start ringing off and I ask you, did you fuck this man directly? That ain't the time for you to have to understand what it's like Man, to be a man. She understood to the point where she said no and put it on her mom's. Yeah, come on. So now, I hear that. so now when you lie oh. to me, see that's the problem. Now when you, hey pop, now when you lie to me, I'm riding with you. I got I'm it. riding with yes. my girl. Yes. I got it. So now I'm riding under false pretenses. I'm mm -hmm. riding, and the other nigga, I'm looking like a goof. I look crazy a now. dickhead out here because I'm defending some shit. Hey, the other it. nigga, the whole industry know y'all was fucking. I'm the last I'm, one to know. Yeah, I'm, I'm on the outside of inside come joke on, at that come point. Come on, come on, come on. The same on. way we was just saying how one thing you, the woman don't want to be is embarrassed. Embarrassed, Cardi yeah. don't want to be embarrassed. She want to be embarrassed. It's Why? the same Men thing. Men don't want to be embarrassed that. either. And yeah. it's a different, it's, it's different it's embarrassment. It's totally different, different with men. Totally different. That's All of that's fair. You don't want to walk in a spot with your girl and this nigga's in there and and. These niggas, they you know got something. You they feel like they got something certain, on you. They looking at you a certain way. Off You're the way. right. You're and then you putting a line in a song. I'm not saying that she wasn't within her right. I'm saying you got to be ready for the for the, whatever whatever come with that. Yeah, what comes after that? You That's do. what I'm saying. You True. Do. Especially when I'm the one that was holding you down. That's why I was the one that was there for you. Mm -hmm. I ain't gonna lie. This son is on my. Back. I gotta, I gotta go put a t-shirt. I try to be cute. We, I mean, we might. I try to be cute. Pull the thing down. No, no, because no, 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 it's beautiful. It's, back it is stunning. It's beautiful. Back. Windows it ain't the clean. Shit on these other pods. That background. Gotta leave it there just okay. for the other pods. It'd be it dope. Does it'd look be really, dope. Really the windows good, is clean. Right? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> A little streaky, oh, a little oh, streaky. I'm just saying. Shit, I'm just they saying. use the newspaper. Wow, they use the newspaper. The JBP man. Wow, this shit used to be all right. They just hit that shit with some what? regular Windex what and what tissue. Happened? Word, They're like rain dried on. I that told y'all, man. Some months we do good as a business. Some months, hey, y'all, get the yeah. fuck out. of <laughs> here. Some months, the ebbs and flows. It'd be bad. Yeah, come on, man. Some months you get it off. Yeah. Other months we don't have money to. Come on. Yeah, we do. Money's getting tight around July. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Wait, All right. Shit. Okay. All right, I got Jane. I got Jane. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. We'll be done way before yeah. that anyway. <laughs> and we're back with an outfit change. And we are back. I had to take my beautiful sweater off. We're no longer twinning. Because, yeah, it's hot as fuck. Hot as a fuck. See, look. Look at Mel. Look at Mel's story. What? I purposely have not clicked Mel's story since she called out for days because I don't want to read it. Why for, what What days are you talking about? All of the days since I've seen you last. Since I've seen you last, I refuse to click on your story. story. I, I was, same thing I did to, I do to my girl when me and her are going through it. No, I'm not looking at none of that shit. You're not going to see my name. Oh yeah, for sure. I, I at missed, all. I missed one. So you I go click through on, with your girl, you'll never look at So I click on mail shit. It says, does anyone want to come on holiday with me? I'm thinking of going to the Bermuda Triangle and just fucking disappearing. That's funny. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> that's that's funny. Yeah, but coming off of not being here, it looked like stop it, Mel. You are well, stop it, Mel. You get what you get. You the, but not, why does everybody not. have to read into like every that's what single they do. like? That's what they do. Ten minutes ago, I said one day you screamed out, "I'm triggered," and stormed off crying. You, we don't trust in your temperament <laughs> enough to say, "Hey, this is a joke." Coming off of your oh, it's so tough. You know it's what? so tough working you, with you, men. You watch, you watch my stories. I routinely post really funny things. As a matter of, I do. I know. Stop. <laughs> Stop. All right. Stop. All right. Stop. All right. Stop. Stop. Saying, Shut up, Corey. Routinely Shut up, Corey. Shut up, Corey. Well, Corey funny. be the problem. He really is. He when really is. Just grab it. a fucking mic, yeah. Corey. He throw okay? it out there. Yeah, he and does. And somebody always pick up, and then it becomes an issue. Mm -hmm. Corey just catch all that male woman bullshit she be doing. Same well, sometimes you just gotta let part of, part of it being woman bullshit is us just turning a blind eye to it. Facts. Or part of it is that's not true. calling that's it true. woman bullshit. Mm, oh, I don't know. I tried to get us out of there. All right, no, but look, no, I love that. Reverse. I love that. Mm -hmm. What should we call it as men? Because <laughs> you do know what it is I'm trying to refer to, but maybe I am using the wrong you... term. So, what? Cause that's where I go wrong with my girl too. Oh, come on with this woman bullshit. Oh, I'm a one head. Oh, fuck. Ah, you got me. I but think, what should we call it I think as the, men? I think the minute that we make the distinction between woman stuff and men stuff, that's when it becomes divisive. Uh, so if we call it a discourse or we call it uh, a dialogue. Pass the fucking ball. Fuck you. Pass the ball. Oh my God. Pass the fucking ball. Pass the fucking ball. 
<laughs> I broke one chord already, not okay? A, a, a discourse. A discourse. Oh, a discourse. man, God, Jesus. God, you know my problem all. is I'm too fucking mature. That's the fucking problem. Uh, That's really the problem. You know no, what I mean? I come up with these no, big-ass fucking words, no, no. and it's just like... I never thought about it that way. And then no. lose sight of all of them when it's time to use use them. Mm. When it's time to articulate. Mm. You can't find a word. Mm. Just, yeah, just memes. My whole meandering. Just memes and spiritual healer. Got it. Instagram. Spiritual, <laughs> spirit healer. Girls always got some fucking... <laughs> always got an Instagram page that just helps them through dark times. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think exactly mine is? what I'm feeling just, yeah. at the moment. <laughs> I'm sure you know what my, what's mine. I just said spiritual healer. Spirit healer, whatever that shit is, you be watching. Spiritual warrior, whatever, Spiritual that, warrior, whatever that bullshit is. That's your page there. My girls is it's saying Le- at the bottom. They tell us every time. My girls is Lebrehu, whatever, <laughs> whatever that Lebrehu girl is that do the readings and the zodiac. Oh man, and she's a lot of girls' favorites. <laughs> I don't know. I've never heard of her. I'll have to Good. check it out. No, though. please. You don't need yeah, any don't more know. weapons. I'll have to check it out. You, you need not another weapon or Instagram. I want to find a way to delete Instagram off your phone remotely <laughs> from, from my house. <laughs> Lock you out of your shit. Yeah. When it, God I, damn it. Here's the thing is I don't take story too seriously. You know, I post memes up there sometimes, you know, like I post Daisy and whatnot, but it's just like, it's like not serious. It's like a fleeting thought. You know uh, what I'm saying? That's not how that works. How does it work, Mr. Holy Technology? <laughs> well, that was condescending. It was. <laughs> 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 Tell me how it works then. When you post shit like that, people read into they're it. Gonna, that, they're waiting for you to post so they can read into Mel it. Mel knows exactly. You what know she that. Was doing. At no point did she even come because I was home waiting for her to just step out there and say, "I say, oh, Mel's active on the story." At some point, she's gonna say, "Hey, come on, guys, be, I'll be right at work uh, the next time." And no, I don't know where y'all are getting any of this from. Don't act like you don't fucking love it. Oh, don't I love act. all of them. I know you do. I love do. it so much. I almost did it. I almost <laughs> called. Like, hey. I almost called. I was like, hey, never. <laughs> oh, shit. I do love it. I yeah. do love it. Because You I, love it too? Is what you're saying? I'm learning. Cap. I'm learning. She loves this shit. Listen. Man. I'm learning. What's happening? Um, well, what's and, that, what else come is on, going on? More relationship news. Stuff, more yeah. relationship what else news. Is fucked up? Mel, uh, what was what was we talking about? A uh, Meg. We were talking Meg. about Meg and oh, Party. Yeah, they released the, uh, the, the drivers. They did the drivers. The drivers affidavit. Now, is that new or old? That's new. That's new. That's, that, was, that, that was dated like this week or last so week. So now, why is that new? Why why didn't we speak to him during the trial? Because he went missing, right? He went missing. Yeah, he went to Africa, right? He showed up. It was like the day before closing arguments started. He showed up at the courtroom ready to testify or whatever, and, and they didn't want to put him on the stand. Um, the prosecution said they weren't prepared for him, and then they also said if he were to testify, it would stretch things past the holidays. And everybody said, never mind. Yeah, who cares if we're getting some justice? Well, why nah, didn't we the, can't drag so justice. Then why didn't the defense say, yes, we want, we want to put him up there? It's a lot of questions about what, what the defense didn't do. So. Okay. There's a lot of questions. Got it. But in the affidavit, I don't know that it really said anything that would change much. About public opinion? We're yeah. not really talking about public opinion right now, right? No, we're not talking about public opinion. We're really? talking about, like, facts of the case. Well, with the affidavit, um, they, of course, they filed for another appeal under habeas corpus. And it's being considered. I got that from Milagro. Did anybody else say that? I, she posted the actual... I saw the see, actual paperwork. See what I mean? No, they, the actual paperwork, though. Like, the actual court paper. People log in. They have to log into that court system shit, and anything that's filed, you can see it. I, I trust think. her to do her due diligence. Yeah, so I did see it. I just um, don't trust me to do it. Yeah, I'm not doing it. I, <laughs> no. I, I, I'm going to be honest with y'all. I don't... I got a loan at Prime already. This is like... The, this is like... I want Playboy 2, though. That's the, yeah. I want Playboy too. I'm sure. Be. And I want uh, Chick's Tape, whatever's next. Chick's Tape 6, 7, whatever it is. I do want that. Playboy 2, I know it's done. I don't know about the Chick's Tape, though. Um, This is the case that will never go away. For sure. Mm-hmm. This is the case that won't go away. Thank you, Tubi. We'll get to y'all in a second. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Tubi's the best shit ever, yo. Yeah, I don't know. I'm getting you. a Tubi now. I keep I'm telling watching you. I was mad bro. I didn't have Tubi. Yeah. I, I came in here and tried to tell my brothers. You did. And sister. Mm. You need Tubi and Zeus. I tried. Let's see. You yeah. had to work that day. Oh. Okay. He came that day. Yeah. He said that. I, I remember him saying that. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Anywho. But, yeah. <laughs> to, but to, it's, well, in the after, affidavit, he said that they were both struggling the gun. He didn't see who shot it. Yeah. So. More so. No, it was, he said a little more. He said more. He, he said a little more. He, he insinuated that 
Kelsey went and got the gun, uh-huh. which is what a lot of people have been saying. Mm-hmm. And he pulled Meg, and then Tori was, like you said, tussling with her. I've heard that from niggas that was involved in mm-hmm. the night. Mm-hmm. That, That's that, been that the story that, that that's that's been was going Kelsey's around. gun. Mm. I don't know if that changes much for his charges. That's I don't think it do. It. All it sounds I, like is she should probably be in jail too. Again, well, she got immunity. Right. What? Yeah, that's the bull. Yeah. That's where you go. <laughs> I, I would have put everything on her head at that trial if I'm Tory. In my defense, she got immunity. I'm firing at her. It was her. I thought that was the play. Me too. I don't know why they didn't do it. It was her. She's from Houston. That's what they do out there. <laughs> I really thought that was the play. They tried to insinuate it without saying it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. No, nigga. Her. I'm going home. I'm sick of this case. Me I'm too. so tired. I don't even want uh, I don't want to be the guy that says, I don't care if we ever get justice because that's foul. But I really am sick of hearing about this case. I think we will never fully 100%. We, everybody's going to have their opinion. I don't think we're ever going to know with like definitively what happened that night and nor do I think I'll think about this on my deathbed either at all I'm not gonna think about this next year yeah I don't think I'm gonna think about it on my regular bed <laughs> that's why I be <laughs> mad in the car <laughs> on my regular bed yeah on the couch <laughs> <laughs> like, the, I don't wanna think about it on this couch easy anymore. chair <laughs> recliner well, well, I am tired of this case futon so, yeah folding chair <laughs> Yeah, no, it's true. I don't want to hear about it. I guess that's why I'm mad at them because I have moved on from the shit and then here they come popping up they with some shit. Well, as long as Tori's in jail and keeps filing appeals, it's constantly okay. going to mm-hmm. be in the news cycle. So we're going to hear about it every time he files an appeal. And there are people that still constantly say he's innocent because he didn't shoot her. Mm-hmm. And those are just, a, that, that's a loud scream. Mm. So I'm be, on that side of the fence. Yeah, I'm, 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 with, I'm with that scream. Yeah, I'm with that scream. But the problem is that's not what he was that's charged charge. with. And they don't understand that. So every little piece that comes out is saying, ha, see, we told you he didn't shoot her. Well, mm-hmm. that's why my fight is that's with what stop. she's doing in the court of public opinion. The charge may stand because that wasn't the charge. Mm-hmm. But in the court of public opinion, she continues to say, he shot me. Right. He shot me. That right. says that a man pulled out a weapon with the intent to fire at mm-hmm. you. I don't believe that. I don't believe There's that. a lot of people that don't believe that. In spite of what your little Hulu doc said, I don't give a fuck about your Hulu doc. <laughs> <laughs> you watched it too. I have a brain. Mm. But I have a brain. They can't just tell me anything and my brain don't start working as someone with some experience in the world. You can't do that to me. Shit. Anyway. Mm. Anyway. Thoughts and thoughts prayers. prayers. Yep. Thoughts and prayers. Yep. 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 I got thoughts and prayers for y'all. It's my son's birthday. I don't give a fuck. All right, fuck it. Let's just cover all the trials. Did y'all see the Jonathan Majors video? <laughs> oh man! <laughs> Did I <laughs> watch that repeat for a minute? Yeah, slow motion. <laughs> you had to. He's a track Where was star. he running? <laughs> Away from her. Far. Away from and her. She, she was keeping right up. She so, had, she had a little and heels. Uh, until she wasn't. That's what I said. I said, "See, that's the problem with you psycho stalkers. You got to be in as good a shape as the nigga that was in Creed." Nah. Yeah. The nigga that was in Creed has been training. Got a little bit more endurance over yeah. here. I, I can go. Yeah, he turned that go. second corner. She started huffing him. <laughs> <laughs> he was still on the move. <laughs> go, Jonathan. I was, I was at home rooting for Run, go! Jump over the guard! Uh, Ju- Juke Ju- left, Juke left. Yeah, no, she's still there. She's still there. Hit the alley. <laughs> That's what I was saying. <laughs> Shout out to Jonathan Majors, man. Y'all I mean, ever been there I've, before? But, huh? Y'all ever been there before? Yes. Yes. Running it was from triggering the girl? a little bit. Yes. yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Right. yeah, I've been there before. This All is right. where a lot. This is where a lot of the resentment come from with niggas that seemingly be throwing some hate on women because you've dealt with that psycho girl before. Mm-hmm. You many people have dealt with that level of psycho. Mm-hmm. Like when I saw that video, I said, "Oh, he had one of those, one of those yep. psychos." Yep, 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 yep. And if you know that the person is one of those psychos then a good third of all those women rules go get thrown out the window. But the women never acknowledge that some of them are the psychos. So, yeah, this story could go differently than it's being publicly painted. That's true. That's where the problem is. That is true. True. To that, you say? We've talked about Meg and Tori. We've talked about Meg and Party. We've talked about Cardi Party and, and Offset. Offset. Mm-hmm. We, now we're talking about Jonathan Majors and, and, uh, and, girl. and, and, Psych- and Grace. Psycho white girl. Yeah. The consistent thread throughout all of this And is- white girls with short hair. <laughs> white girls with short hair. Don't just laugh over it. <laughs> 
I don't, I, again, I can't speak to the level of psychosis. Them single woman white has. female cut her hair. Uh, she, y'all, y'all probably she, too young for that. No, uh, yeah. Ice and Bark. No, don't do that. I think single white female cut her hair when a girl cut her hair. She and styled she was, her hair to look exactly. And now like she was her. a white girl with a short haircut. Yeah. And that is y'all think Jada Pinkett is bad. <laughs> yeah. All right. Keep his wife's name out your mouth. The short hair girls, we do have to have a talk about them at some point. I'm trying to think. Well, you guys are gonna have to. I don't. I don't know what happens. Like short hair makes you crazy. Go ahead. Okay. Go ahead. Just basically saying that there's a lot of gray area. All of it's spilling out into the public sphere, but there's mm-hmm. so much gray area of the stuff that we don't know. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? There's like, in terms of the microaggressions and all the shit that happens that compiles up into like the moment where everything fucking explodes, that's what we're seeing. We're seeing the explosion and we're all like pontificating about who's crazier, who's the crazier one in the situation. And it's just all muddy water. You know what I'm saying? So when I look at the Jonathan Majors situation, what I'm seeing is I'm seeing a guy who's literally trying to avoid a physical conflict. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm saying. But mm-hmm. I've all... So how's it muddy water? Huh? What's muddy about that water? What's muddy about is the state of their relationship and how it even got to that point. That's the muddy water. if you see somebody yeah, right. actively running away from somebody? Because we... There's also the car. There's also what transpired in their car. There's all, the, all, all this... But I've been... The guy that's beating up the girl is not also trying to run away from the girl. You forget. I'm the one that came in here and was team Jonathan Majors from start. That's true. What does that mean? It, meaning, that it? meaning that I have always been on the side of I think that Jonathan Majors is is being maligned in this situation. We have to wait for all of the facts to come out. So I've been on the side of on his side. You have, yeah. What? I'm with you. you yeah, you, you did say that. So I'm just saying there's like there's just like a consistency like in terms of like the theme of what we're talking about in terms of relationship. Waters get muddy when we start talking about people's relationships and the explosions that we witness, but not everything that is like the lead up to it. All of like the minute things that add to what it becomes. Okay. But now, uh, if if that was reversed. No, in this situation, I think he's running to protect himself. He was. A thousand percent. That's that's what I see. Okay. That's That's what I see. That's my answer to this. That is what I see. Okay. Yeah. That's what it looked like. Like I said, that's somebody that's been there before. So then call out the psycho white girl. So you saying you don't know what got her to that point? I, because I don't know her. We don't have to, we, but if she, if, if, what? if I'm fearful enough, that's why I asked you, if this is reverse and a woman is running from a dude, we're not going to sit there and say, well, what happened to get to that point? It's going to be, yo, she's clearly trying to get away yeah. from this nigga. Yeah, I get it. Out. And I'm not going to say that it sounds I, like you're playing both sides of the No, I'm not going to say that I agree with her actions. I'm not going to say that at all. Then, I am. We, then say I disagree. I disagree with how she handled herself, but in the throes of like that level of emotion and hysteria and stuff like that, I think that it's really reductive to call somebody a psycho. And again, I am been team Jonathan Majors, but I get maybe it's a little triggering. No, she's psycho. That's okay. psycho. She's psycho. I know that women have a problem. Some women have a problem with being called psycho or crazy. But some of that shit is psycho and crazy. Chasing someone that clearly wants to get away from you, regardless of your gender, even, is even if it's in the name shit. of love, yeah, it's it's psycho and crazy. And there are better ways to deal with uh, problem management. There's better ways to troubleshoot. Agreed. Told- and if I gotta run away from you, that's bad. And I know I could physically overpower you. There is some psychosis there. If I'm, some, I'm, I'm afraid. I'm chasing my partner in the street who just came off of the biggest movie in his career. He's recognizable. He's famous. I am not playing I'm my part. All of that. Right. Yeah, yeah. No, it's, I'm not in my right yeah. No, it's funky. Like it's it's Actually, a it's 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 it's, yeah. it's, a, it's messy. It's like it's super messy. Again, this is not in defense. It's just the word psycho is ex- okay. is, is, is to me is, is like is super more. reductive because we I'm don't. I'm trying to reduce her. <laughs> Got it. I'm Got trying it. to figure out why you're not trying to reduce her. <laughs> Some people don't do that. Some people don't want to call you psycho. They're like, oh, you got to be diagnosed, and I don't know what else happened. But that's some crazy. That's shit, some psycho bro. shit. That's some crazy shit. I think because as a woman, a lot of times when you are emotional, even to the smallest degree, I'm not. Right. I know what you're <laughs> doing. Huh? It's a, it's it, it's a thing. Trick for 
What? Oh God, here we go. <laughs> here we go. No, I know. I see. I see. It's true. I see the lane she As a woman, she any emotional reaction, you get labeled this. psycho, crazy, and it's triggering. And but it's this isn't just any this ain't just reaction. reaction. I know. I know. I'm not falling for it. Yeah. She almost got me. Pass the fucking ball. <laughs> Pass the ball. <laughs> She almost got me. Damn, pass the fucking ball. This is the part of the pod where I normally stare at Ish, like nah, Ish stare even. Ish into oblivion. Because he'll, he'll like bite this. and say something. No, he tries to look straight and not look at me. Nope. And that makes me laugh. Well, and it makes me do We're going to get completely off of that. There we go. There we go. We out of there. But there was some more, there was some more funny video. Hey! Thing. It was. This one offended me personally. Okay. This was the Michael B. Jordan Ferrari crash. Uh, did y'all see it? I did see it. I saw it. Mm -hmm. I saw As it. a Jersey resident, a Nork, being from Nork, he grew up in Nork. We got the will in Nork. <laughs> Don't do that. We got the will. That looked like bro, regular yeah. Jersey driver shit to me. Yeah. And nah. bulls, apparently, right? Nah. 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 <laughs> You got bulls while I'm parading in your Serato? There, there are bulls. There's a loose bull in North. Y'all do some On the nut, subway track. Y'all do some that was, that was kind shit. of shit. We didn't do that. I don't know where that fucking bull came it. from. It came from Newark. <laughs> What's y'all shit called? The path. He was on the path. He was on the path That's train. a Newark bull. A fucking bull running downtown North, bro. That is crazy. And none of y'all shot him. He breathing. I... He alive. Nobody had fresh Angus. <laughs> That's crazy to me. Bro. Nobody right. got smoke with him. Jersey man. City niggas would have ended that, but go ahead. Go ahead. That ain't good. Yeah, for real. <laughs> Deep roasted that nigga. <laughs> nah, that's that. Put him in the pit <laughs> underground. Cook. Jersey what, City niggas would have cooked him with a lighter. Little, 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 little 14 <laughs> hour roast. Everybody put a lighter right, lighter right out and cook this Angus. <laughs> yeah, All right, what was we saying now? Nah, it's about the Ferrari crash, man. He, he, he racing some dude on the highway. Wait, is that what he was doing? Was, Not on the highway. It wasn't even on the highway. It was on the street. Yeah. It was a street. Excuse me. It was a street. He was racing on a street. He was racing another Ferrari. Yeah. I didn't see nobody else racing. Oh, no. Was, no, it was, there's a Ferrari right next to him. Right and that right as they took off, he just smacked, side swiped a bunch of parked cars. <laughs> there's got to be something. To, there's got to be a level of wealth you get to you just where you do that. Shit. Just start driving races on the street? Oh, no. Niggas do that. They just don't have Ferraris. But like, rest in peace that. to, uh, what's Tyrese man name? Paul, 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 Paul Walker. Paul Walker. Rest in peace to Paul Walker. Like, the type of guy I am when I read about certain deaths, like, I'll try to not do what was fatal in the story. Like, if I read a story that say, hey, this dude drove his Porsche or his vehicle at 175 miles per hour and lost control or the car overreacted or crashed, nothing about reading that makes me say, I'm going to give that a shot. Nah, man. When you that's ego, egos and adrenaline start going, especially when you think I'm, there's I'm a traffic there's light a right there. I'm speaking. Look, there's I'm a speaking, stoplight. I'm ahead. speaking from a nigga that has done that. There's a stop sign coming. I have done that. Yeah, but you did it like you did it in PA or somewhere. No, I didn't. Where I you did. was at? Coming across the Skyway from Jersey City to North in a SL 600. Oh yeah, V12. Dummy. You a dummy too. Get you off the street. <laughs> Racing. You know, that, that was the. That you did, we used to call that shit the autobahn. When you come out the Holland Tunnel and you shoot across, it was a straight shot. I did that too. Mm -hmm. That was that yeah. was you getting it off right over there. But yeah, I've done it. But even over there, there's that curve. It's a curve. You just got to know that curve is coming. You got to take. You got to know how to drive. That curve is coming. Now you got to know the road. The road is going to do some you shit. You have to know how to drive though. You yeah. should not yeah. drive a vehicle at that speed. You Without go that knowing fast. what to anticipate. On local streets. You should make it go that fast. That's why I we'll would never get a motorcycle. Real talk. Same. I know me. I've always said if I get a bike, or if I do, it's gonna be one of them big slow shits. Yeah. The cruisers. Yup. Mm -hmm. The kind of the old niggas wear where you just playing music all day. It's gonna be one of those. <laughs> the shit with the big one trunk of, thing yeah, on the back. All that shit with the saddle Speakers. side. All that. Got a sandwich yeah, in yeah. the back. Yeah, the whole shit. It's sitting there, my shit got a screen on it. <laughs> Fucking door. Yeah. But the big seat that you can't fall off. Yeah, yeah. You can't even fall off the shit. You just. If I got a bike, I would end myself just doing know, some dodo bruh, shit. I always wanted a bike. My man got then, a fucking. Um, uh, uh, Suzuki, Jixxer, uh -huh. fucking dash say 260 on it. Nope. Yeah, see. I know me. I wouldn't want to go no 260 I on a bike. That's you probably crazy. can't hit 260 in it, but I, I wouldn't want to go two on a bike. I know me. I'm going to sit there and say, oh, it's a straightaway. Ain't no cars coming. Yeah, let me, oh, let me, oh, I'm getting there. Let me see what I can do. Dog, it's I, over. At a buck 30, things start happening differently Facts. in the vehicle and your response. And how your car is handling wind. It's and the fastest just, you've ever mm -hmm. driven. 
Uh, probably around like 120, 130, somewhere in that range. 130, 140. I did 150. In America, 130. 154 was the fastest. You okay? I'm yeah. fine. I mean, debatable. I'm fine, bro. That explains a lot. Nah. That's why you are the way you are. <laughs> no, well, yeah. I won't do that shit again. <laughs> Yeah. Bro, you can't even feel vibration. 160. Yeah, exactly. That should be Everything too smooth. Just, and the car felt like, it was like I said, it was SL600, brand yeah. new. So it was like, I'm riding on air. Show off. <laughs> nah, it wasn't mine, nigga. <laughs> oh, that's the bad part. Nobody asked Doing me about that's me, shit. Well, women can't drive. How fast? 160. Sit down. I was driving a Bugatti on the 95. All right, all right, we don't care. Yes, that shit we took off care. like a rocket ship. It was very scary. So I was like, whoa, <laughs> can't handle this. Why you got to okay, stun so, on niggas? Though. Well, or, because I had to let you know how, what, what the car, car was. That it, was it your car? Shut up. <laughs> so it wasn't your car and it wasn't your no, car? No, it's a stupid car purchase. money, y'all. There's poor people around. <laughs> With your broke ass. <laughs> You niggas in there telling stories Yo, from hold somebody else's car. What a bunch of bums. So what? <laughs> what so a, what? Hold on, hold on. What hold a hold bunch on. of losers. So that 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 never got it. Shut up. Just you never seen it again. <laughs> I never, I didn't like it actually. She didn't see that, she didn't see that other car get either. <laughs> I'm playing. I'm sorry. Wow. I'm sorry. It really? was right there at the God room. I had to just. You had to know you were coming into some jokes. Oh, yeah. It's, cool. it's a light jokes. We got mm-hmm. other ones. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Anywho. Nah, man, that drop made me think about something. Fuck y'all ahead of time. Okay. I gotta get that out the way. Let me up again. I get, I get, <laughs> like you're to say some I got, I'm so glad Ish not here. So a report came out that Red Lobster is now operating at a loss. No. It's like $11 million quarterly loss because they brought endless shrimp back. And they're realizing that people are eating way more shrimp than they anticipated. So they're losing money. I was proud of that because I have partake in the endless shrimp festivities quite a few times since it's been back. And I'm getting my wait, money's worth. you work. currently go to Red Lobster and get some endless shrimp? Oh, nigga, I might go to Red Lobster when I leave. <laughs> yeah, this nigga is. I'm going to tell you how I order. He is such a cool. I order like my three different styles. Uh-huh. And then as I finish, I'm like, oh, bring me these four. And I just keep them coming. Yeah. That sounds... Speaking of cooking, if you hear some crackling oh, yeah, in yeah. the background... Getting Joe Burgers. Ooh, the real just, ones. The real ones. My dad. The original. The oh, real so ones. Fuck y'all. No, well, just, you that's know. my dad who stopped by. Shout out to Pop. Shout out to Pop. With some Joe Burgers. Pop, you want to go to Red Lobster after, after this? Lost, they got endless shrimp. See if he lost his touch. Damn, I can't ever get nobody to go with me. Though. For the audience out there, I also let him know that we do have an open microphone it's available. Right there. If ever he wants to sit down and share anything, I know y'all been asking to see him and he's been here a lot, but y'all might not know, now is a bad time. Oh, man. He can't come sit down now. Mm. Anything that, good? That's all That's all I can say. He can't come sit down now. They're, get in get, trouble on the podcast. Yeah, they're, they're oh, yeah. It, oh, yeah. Yeah, you yeah. got to be careful with these mics. Uh-huh. Yeah. See, the thing about these mics that I learned is what you say in these mics, people actually hear it. Loud. Clear. Like a bunch of people. Yeah, 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 that's the part that I ain't really connect that first. Then they start sharing it around. Uh, yeah, <laughs> sending yeah, it. Yeah. 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 Well, if you think, oh, this person might not hear it, but they're they, gonna hear they it. friend heard it. Mm. They homegirl heard it. Yep. And they see, oh, well, he is. One, that one thing podcasting has taught me. Everything that I say and feel on Friday, I say and feel totally differently Saturday. But so I feel totally different in the car on the way home. You're going to be held to your Friday take. Yeah, indefinitely. I be home like nah. This is like y'all. this is like, you know, when you get read your rights and anything you say can and will be used against you sure. in a court yeah. of law. Well, yeah. also on a podcast, Mike. That's true. That's true. Plus, people like to misinterpret things a lot too, so that's an added element. And what you meant doesn't matter. It's what they Facts. they no. You meant this. No, that's that's not what I was trying to say. No, that's what you said. Speaking of getting read your rights, John ja Morant is currently learning why you don't run around just punching people in the face. That is true. It's not because you shouldn't do it. Not because people aren't disrespectful, or not because it's not fun. <laughs> no, none of those are the reason why people stop doing that. You stop doing it because if you do it enough, you'll end up in court with a prosecutor asking you to walk us through punching this kid in the face in slow motion. <laughs> show, show us how you did it. Show, show me how boy, you boy, will you look annoyed. John ja Moran looks so annoyed in court <laughs> with that lady saying, show me how you throw a punch. Come on, punch me. No, did you, see, did you see when she asked him, um, is your jewelry real? Yes. <laughs> yeah. look, Deadpan. I could hear it. That was the other drop. It was like I wanted four to, other words. That's the other drop I wanted to put in. 
<laughs> I'm, a, I'm a millionaire, man. I wanted to put that in, too. I, I figured y'all would be mad at me, so I didn't. You may as well. He looked at her like, bitch. <laughs> That's what I, I wonder said. how many times he said that word in his head. Wow. Then that same lady asked him to pass a basketball to her. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> She in there. This is the she clown. She having fun. She in there having fun. This is why. This, this is she putting up a triple double. Yeah. 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 She putting numbers on the board. She is having a blast. You want to do stupid shit to I'm end gonna, up in front of this lady? Shit. Let me show you what this lady's job is. <laughs> Let's reenact is. all that dumb shit. Yeah. He in slow mo. Bothered. Some worlds just shouldn't clash. John Morant's world should not clash with this prosecutor, but he did it to himself. And she's so going to pay for it. Go through all of the bullshit. Yep. Uh-huh. Go through it. And they ain't about to charge him with nothing. They respect him. He's job and rent. They're going to get him out of there. No, yeah. this is just... They already spoke to Adam Silver. Yeah, this is all Adam Silver. Yeah, Adam Silver been sent this bag in. They paid for this already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the white lady just got to make a name. When you get in there, I'm going to put a basketball on the court. I want you to demonstrate. Make sure you gonna You're going to do some annoying shit, but th- this is your punishment. Yeah. This is it. This is what you got. Now you got to go through this. Joe Berg is smelling good. Now. They really they are. are. I, I keep looking over there. It's too. hard. hard to pod with that I'm, Yeah, I'm here. starting to hear the crisp from the pan. Uh-huh. That's just sounding like a <laughs> hey, all right now. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, all right, so prayers and thoughts and love, whatever to John Morant. Yeah, oh. a lot of thoughts and prayers. Yeah, man. hopefully you're fine. Grizzlies are doing horrible. Oh, shit, what do y'all think about the 90s being back in the NBA? Yo. <laughs> what do y'all think I'm about? I'm usually a very staunch supporter of not only Draymond, but in general, a little bit of violence on the basketball court. A little mm-hmm. bit of hard-nosed basketball. I miss that shit from the 90s. I miss the Knicks. I miss the Pistons. I miss Bruce Bowen and that. Like, people just playing, doing some dirty shit out there. But, come on, man. <laughs> come on, man. No, you Enough's know, enough. You know, you know why? You know why? What the this, fuck was that that I just watched? <laughs> you know why it's bullshit? Because them 90s players, they ain't try to explain it. True. They stood in their shit, Yeah. But they also didn't do that goofy fucking whatever that shit was. Like that, that wasn't flail even around. that, yeah. That shit wasn't well, dope. He, he flailed the wrong way. <laughs> he said he was trying to sell the call. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was just, you know. That was a real bad excuse. That really was. Especially two weeks after choking up Rudy Gobert. Which I liked. That other <laughs> one where you kicked homeboy all in the chest that while he was on the stomped floor. Him, yeah. You that stomped on my man's chest. There was a period of a whole season where you was kicking niggas in the ball. <laughs> that is true, too. <laughs> it, was, it was a whole season of that. that you have the little that super clip about. they put out with the... With the uh, they just had a compilation of great music. music. Oh, my yeah. God. I was crying. I loved the, yeah, I loved the super cut. Yeah. It's crazy. How long, how long y'all think he get? He's got to sit for a while. More than 10. Yeah. 15? He might sit half More than 10. 15? Oh, maybe more than that. A 20 piece? Maybe. Yeah. Sheesh. Well, I guess it would be a quarter of the year. He might just sit for a little while. Yeah, they said we're, we're taking into account all of your previous behavior. And if they're doing that, 10-15 oh, yeah, they're going to hang you. Well, they they're said indefinitely, so doesn't that mean this? Well, that doesn't mean the season, does it? No, no indefinitely means we haven't come up with a number yet. Right. So it's just, it means right now there's no return. Whatever we say. And then we'll mm. come back to this revisit and give you the actual number. And some of this is, is punishment to the Warriors for not nipping this in the bud and handling this in the appropriate way so that it don't have to get to the league. They do have to set an example. They do. And, this is and, not the and, basketball they And want. that's the third layer of this is they have to set an example just because they missed it so many times. Yeah. That's true, too. Too yeah. many times did they they yeah. missed it. They had, they, they, I agree yeah, with The that. gavel got to come down there. I agree with yeah, that. Yeah, enough's enough. Because that's not the league that you want. You yeah, got, this, that's not the league today. That's they, what they it taught me. can't sell that. It taught me it ain't just the, the league that don't want to see that 90s shit no more. I've changed too. I don't, I used to love it too, like Park said. I mean, even though I, as a Nick fan in the 90s, I've been on the wrong end of <laughs> league punishment for fights. That's true. Mm-hmm. That is true. Uh, that heat series. The, the, yeah, heat the heat series. Heat they made up the rule. Players left. Players <laughs> they left the, the bench. bench. Yep. Yep. We're changing the rule. Players cannot leave the bench, or it's an X amount of game suspension. Mm-hmm. Yep. We was up in that series. Two zip. That was in the days where you only needed three to win. First round, I think. Yep. Yeah. Fucked us. Sure they did. fucked us again. They fucked us with that that's, Van Gundy fight. All of them Nick Miami fights. The Knicks got fucked in. But whatever. I don't want to see Bill Lane Bay and Rick Mahorn just close lining people on the on the court. I well, don't. I, I don't mind seeing that. It's just the, the goofy like what that was an unnecessary swing. It was like if you're gonna swing on them, swing on them and stand in it. Stand in it. Yeah, don't I swung on you, motherfucker. Well, no, that's Spin the, around. It's, it's the passive aggressive way of doing it because now you got you, you think you need an excuse to get out of it. That's why I'm corny. I agree with you. 
That's that's what it is today. Because you, you play, can't. You know, I'm not just going to swing on you, like, but I have to make it look like it was an accident. Oops, I accidentally hit you. That's why I don't mind like the Ru- Rudy Gobert one because it's like, oh no, you violate. I'm going to come in here. And yeah, and show that you was what's an, up. That was an enforcer, that's an enforcer move. move. Right yeah. This right here was just some goofy shit. Like you had to do I all agree. that. Pretty much. And dude really sold the. Lay, oh, he uh, sold it. Yeah, ground. yeah, he sold it. He did. He really laid there for a good amount. See, of that's time. the you other can't part. Play with people, that's the other part today. Yeah, you playing yeah. with the Karens out here <laughs> today? They will sell it <laughs> if you put yourself in that boat. Shit, I was trying to find out how to say I was in one of them cars that Michael B. Jordan hit. <laughs> <laughs> like, where did this happen? What time? That neck hurt a little bit. <laughs> Just saying, people will sell it. Yeah, enough's enough. You guys it. Sorry, Jermon. Speaking yeah, of selling yeah. it. Yeah. Wow, Ice. <laughs> I just want to say wow to you. Like, what a day for you to be so on point with these segues. <laughs> but where are you going with this? I have no idea. I, I hate you. Yeah. <laughs> Who's selling something? <laughs> Somebody selling stuff? <laughs> I missed the story. That's what y'all do in this part that I love. Oh, really? I missed that one. <laughs> no. no, no. <laughs> a word. Got it. Cash Doll has hey, lost the OnlyFans. Friend of the show. Shout out to Cash, Cash Doll. Doll. Get that money. Is now on OnlyFans. <laughs> says she is taking on the responsibility of changing the way OnlyFans is viewed. It is not uh, just somewhere for porn or X-rated shit. Yes, it is. It's not, well, but it is. It is. I mean, if you want to have a lucrative OnlyFans. I was just going <laughs> right. to say. I was about to I say. Mean, are you trying to make some money or not? Nah? You can go to somewhere else and do that. Yeah, if it's you announced be. it was on OnlyFans because you know the attention that comes with you being on, you even saying that you're on OnlyFans. Yeah, that's no, Because if it ain't OnlyFans, it's, I'm out. Yeah, it's not. I, if I sign up over there, it's Instagram pics. Somebody signed up and was like, "This is what you're doing." This is what you're doing on over OnlyFans. There. Yeah, and what you doing? Saw it. it was like she was doing the WAP. <laughs> she was doing like nah. some old school dance. Naked? No. No. Fully dressed. Naked. Fully dressed. Yeah, oh, naked, guy, you can go ahead and do the walk. Yeah, yeah, you can do whatever yeah, you, you do want. do the robot, yeah. nigga. I'm going to fuck. Yeah, the, the dead bitch. <laughs> plank. Just be a corpse. Put a plank in back. <laughs> I don't care what you're doing. <laughs> oh, man. Listen, what what do we have to say to Cash Doll announcing that she's on OnlyFans now? She said OnlyFans gave her a bag for that. I'm Get your money. They're playing, they're playing games over there. We just saw the dude with the, the Ruby Rose shit. Not even a little bit that of hate. Was, it's so hate. not hate. That I am. Hate. That was hate. Do not call it hate. I love cash Get your off. money is hate it for is somebody me. to get a big bag for the same thing that you're doing. That's hate. No. It's congratulating her. Why would I Congratulations hate? Congratulations could be hate too. Wait, Mel, you still got your OnlyFans? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Did they give you a big bag for it? No, they did not. They didn't ask <laughs> Stop, me to clean that shit up. I didn't mean it that up. way. Gotta, it's true. They didn't ask me to clean that shit up. I wish they fucking did. But hey, you know, whatever. That's why I'm saying congratulations. I wish I'd gotten the bag. Not hate. Congratulations. From the feet pics? I mean, my feet are motherfucking cute. We established that. See, there was a whole transaction that happened. There was. You know, involving yeah, my yeah. fucking feet. Yeah, there was. You know. But we're talking about cash doll. If I manage you, I would bring all the proposals back to <laughs> you and his feet shit. Hey, listen. <laughs> Charles <laughs> from Connecticut <laughs> says he has at least 30 bands. Ruby Rose who? <laughs> Charles got 30 bands for you to just walk on his back. Butt ass. <laughs> butt ass, yo. Yeah. It's syrup. I don't, I don't know what you're doing with these fucking feet pics. I'm here for it. I'm here for it. Then fuck these feet. Word. Get yeah. to it. Okay. Look, get to it. Oh, no. She's going to call out some more? <laughs> oh, God. No, we mean on no, your off I mean, days. Oh, my yeah. God. When you're not I here mean, working, yeah. I mean, like, get I to it. it. I got it. I got it. This nigga take off for of Oh, <laughs> my God. They out there. Well, it's cold outside today. And they, and they paying. I think I want to stay in. Mm. I want to stay indoors. Anyways. I want to pop from bed today. What y'all think about the, the Ruby Rose dude saying it was all a, a marketing scheme? To do what? Well, did y'all say what y'all th- did? Y'all finish with your cash doll? Oh no, I just, just think the industry. Sure. I mean, uh, it's it's funny. I mean, I know she's not going to be doing what people would expect when they heard her she's doing OnlyFans. Yeah, the, the, yeah, not for the first year. <laughs> you think it's going to happen? Now nah, I'm not saying cash doll, but I know typically when the girls say, "Hey, I'm not doing none of this," you just got to wait that year. After that first year, spice it up a little bit. No, I just. Yeah. I mean, they're about to their choice. 
Sure, sure, sure. Not that's my goal. Oh, wait, I can make how much? I just got to sit around and be patient. <laughs> oh, wait, how much? All I, all I got to do is wait. <laughs> wait till the review Seven. guy comes in, yeah. gives us the update. And if you take it too late, all you got to do is send, all you gotta do is send a couple of emojis and a direct message on OnlyFans. They start sending you special shit, private. Hey, I, I never put this out. You want it? <laughs> yeah. 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 I got 20 bucks for you, no problem. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> hmm. I've been in the house for two weeks just sending $20. <laughs> little, little 30 feet. <laughs> expensive on OnlyFans and expensive in the New York strip club, totally different. Right? <laughs> on OnlyFans, I'd be like, $34.99. <laughs> and you're Is doing that- what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck it. <laughs> fuck it. All right, fuck it. I'll go ahead and give it a little $34. Send it. <laughs> send it I'll take that. Fuck these strip clubs. Words easy. <laughs> they ain't doing shit for thirty. They ain't, they, went and, they not making you a drink for thirty. I'll just say you can't get a drink. Nigga. You can't get no water, a hookah, nothing. a chair. You can't get a bottle of you beer for thirty. They can't look at you. You can do this right here all you want. You actually, not getting for thirty four dollars, you can the fuck out in a timely <laughs> in a timely manner. Actually, actually, you get out that seat, you holding somebody's spot that's coming to spend some yeah. money and that standing space. Don't even stand. Yeah, don't stand there. Yeah. Levitate, Back nigga. Off. Back off. <laughs> 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 Out of here. Oh man, I'm so happy Mel's back. Yeah, yeah. thank you. Oh, For yeah. real. Oh, but by the way, Ruby Rose is the dude who was saying it was Cap and shit like that. Yeah, he's doing. He's saying multiple things on different platforms. Duh. He's <laughs> on a totally different platform bragging about his level of wealth. Yeah. But on the yeah, I'm yeah. yeah. So he was not on any platforms before this. Yeah. No, I know. <laughs> now I'm lit. Nah. I say whatever I want. Yeah. Nah, that's gotta fly. And I got money. Yeah. I blew yeah. up. I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go to uh, say a bunch of shit. shit. Yeah. Yeah. Change the story at all of these pods. Yeah. yeah. Nothing you could do about. Hey, it. I like that better than you go tell the same story at every pod. Facts. Yeah. Parson. Now I'm go- <laughs> Switch it up a little bit. <laughs> now I'm gonna go over here and say and get some shit off over here. The exact opposite over there. Y'all figure it out. I don't give a fuck. I'm lit. Sixty grand for the Ruby Roll. All right. On another pod. On another pod, we'll talk. <laughs> I can't, we can't do it here. No, 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 no. 60 grand for the Ruby Rose? I mean, why don't we invite her up here? Why? For what? I don't know. Because she got 60 what? grand in her pocket. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. I, that, maybe to ask her. There go that Mixie jumping out of here. <laughs> <laughs> you can't even. You can't trying even, to network. She can't even control the Mixie. <laughs> she says, why don't we invite her? Ruby man, that hand. You could do it from your OnlyFans and be like, "Why would we ever want to be go in a subscribe room with Ruby Rose?" Yeah. To oh my talk. God, yeah. what the fuck? That is fucked up of you to say. What you don't think that she has anything else to offer? You just look, look at look where you just went. Look where you just went. No, why would I, we have her up on this pod? <laughs> yeah, that's a valid question. Okay. Look, you want to invite all the girlies, right? <laughs> Listen, you and Angie do that shit on your own time. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, this guy. The fuck? That's hate. Who else was up Uh-oh. there? Wait, who else was up there? You, you and... uh, <laughs> Get that nigga, Mel. That's fucking hate. Get him. Mm-hmm. Wait, who was up there? You and Jess is hilarious. Go do that shit whenever y'all... Wait, what are you time. talking about? Who was up there? The women's empowerment shit, you and Angie? Who else? Uh, Sherry. Oh, yeah. June. Nice. Lola Brooke. You yeah. keep on Big hating? Gator. You don't do that shit up there. Okay. Look at Ice. See, look how Ice turned on me. Right? <laughs> I, I love Ice because he gets to just turn on whoever. <laughs> I, I get out of there, bro. I keep Yo, trying to tell y'all I to get out of y'all, there. Man. Y'all I stay there and then have to deal with the consequences. I know, because she there. leaned right into Aunt June and yep. this woman yep. disrespect her and disrespect yeah. her. Yeah. What do you think of her? Yep. How about her? To right disrespect out. us all with the woman <laughs> Votron. <laughs> Uh, what else? Oh, what else? What else? What else is important up there? Yeah, that's right. That's right. Look at you. We took a little break to eat some Joe Burgers. Slamming. Thanks, Pop. Thank you, Pop. Thanks, Ice Pop. looked to the side. Oh, y'all still sitting down ready to work. Well, yeah, your little kitchen crew ain't here. I think I was still eating. Flip ish. All of the kitchen mongers. <laughs> the niggas that just hang around the microwave. You know what it is? Mel is in the kitchen crew too. I am so not in the kitchen crew. Please. I am Mel, stop. Ru- Mel, you don't know. Routinely oh. just sitting here. I'm routinely sitting here. You do sit there a lot, but you hang out in the kitchen a lot too. Yeah. When, when I'm, she's yo, you eating. know nothing about yourself. When, when I'm making eating. a coffee, when I'm making a tea, or heating up some food yeah. and actually eating it. When you're standing in it. front of the microwave eating your food with your ass out while, while everybody was like, yeah, that one. 
mics. Yeah, when you bend it down in front of the microwave, just stand there for man long and it's only the microwave. <laughs> the microwave's low. <laughs> yeah, it's not that. up high. I got you, man. Yeah, yeah. fuck out of here. Yeah. I, ain't, I ain't falling for none of that shit. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, is there anything else that... Uh, they acting up on the internet. They are. I'm telling Boy, you something. I see it. They um, going crazy. This was such a great day to have a calm pod mm. and a calm weekend. Every time I look at my phone, there's some more shit happening. They going crazy, dog. Nick and Cardi, uh, mm -hmm. Nicky and Cardi's firing mm -hmm. at each other mm -hmm. about their husbands. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Report on it. Go ahead. Who? <laughs> <laughs> Who? I wasn't even bringing it up. Well, I mean, you got to bring it up because it's our gig, but I, it? I don't have nothing to say about it. <laughs> oh, me neither. That's that's out of man podcast gossip land. Yeah. There you go. There See, you go. the Sweet. women can get catty with the fight. Mm. Facts. And that's normally who wins, the cattiest girl. <laughs> Men can't do that. Once y'all start including the husbands, that's past man law. Very far. Which is why we hired a woman. <laughs> <laughs> Take it away, Mel. What do you Fuck think? That. Fuck what do you that. Fuck that. What do you think, Mel? Fuck that. <laughs> no, Mel had a New rough. New y'all motherfuckers ain't not setting me Mel up. Mel didn't talk about nobody for the rest of the year. New. You get a pass, Mel. Yeah. Thank you. You, you can just talk about like the, the beef Fuck with the mailman that. and shit. Yeah. Don't even do that. Then we had a postal service yeah. up our ass. No, nope. cool. Nope. And then she'd be in the corner crying about the mail being late. <laughs> <laughs> How could that mailman do this to me? <laughs> All I said was. <laughs> All right, what up? What up? Uh, uh, there is some more shit going on. Oh, that the lyric girl that we highlighted is now kicking our back in. Is she? Ice, what do you think yeah, about that? Yeah, she is. The lyric girl that highlighted all of the uh, statutory problematic rapey, problematic yeah, yeah, yeah. lyrics that we also highlighted uh -huh. is now shitting on us because we didn't say her name. Mm -hmm. Oh, I didn't know her name. And our take, when we was, when Joe was like, no, we got to get her off the internet. Like, of course, joking on an entertainment Broadcast. We're laughing about it. That's the problem with some of you young earthy hoes. Oh man. What? All of they all they know is earth young earthiness. They don't have the experience to know a, a or even fathom another POV. And that'd be my problem with some of this shit. She highlighted it. I liked it. We highlighted it. Uh -huh. It is an issue in mm -hmm. hip hop. It mm -hmm. is. And now because we didn't highlight you, we get our back kicked in even though we agree with the message. All of that's nasty shit. These people think that they are bigger than the cause they represent. Mm. It's also, it speaks to today, though. Well, you know, with, with everybody living in this that, social... That applies uh, to somebody else, too. I ain't going to say it. Uh, please don't. Yeah, I'm yeah. never going to say it. I know what you mean. I'll I never know. say it again. But today, it's a lot about the credit, too. So people, you know, people, a lot of people get their shit stolen. You know, they get their thoughts stolen, their ideas stolen. Their, so in her instance, in her case... Not to speak for her, but there are people that create things and highlight things, and then somebody else come and attach. And your to shit it is gonna get stolen and plagiarized and all types of shit. But again, today it's, it. it's, it's, it's it's big about yo. Give me my credit for that. Oh, like, I did that. Oh please, please. It's just the time we in today. Please, we're gonna highlight it. But at the end of the day, we're on MC Light side. <laughs> like, what the fuck is she talking about? I was trying to do the math. We're not what, choosing how old you. Was I when she We're not that? choosing you over MC like lyric could, girl. Could it be? Damn. You're part of the problem. <laughs> <laughs> That'll fix me up. Hey, newsflash. I've never cared about being part of the problem. <laughs> I Most times, you, might you actually are the problem. Relish I'm, being I'm the core of the, of problem. the problem. I am the root of the shit. <laughs> it begin, the problem begins with me. It wasn't even a problem at until you house. got there. Yeah, what the fuck? That don't bother me at all. <laughs> Y'all and all the Christians typing that shit to me. Anyway. <laughs> yo, yo hip-hop will get you in beef with everybody. Word. It don't matter. Holy shit. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Uh, Nikki Khan leaving that. Yeah, I'm, no, 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 no. I ain't touching yeah, that. No. Kanye is just. I'm off of him too now. That's how phony I am. I'm done with. Want the music, man. He's going too. He's going too great. That's all I want. Yeah. He keep trying to trick us. It's with, gonna leak though. So I'm. I'm cool. It'll. It'll leak. I only want to hear from him over a beat. It's gonna. All leak. this other shit he talk about with yes, Jules Taylor. <laughs> yes. Oh my God. I was, a, I was shocked to see Cuddy there. Yo, what a nasty way to have a billion dollars. Bruh. That nigga makes a billion look nasty and icky. Nah. <laughs> he don't make a billion look good. 
He run yeah. around barefoot, no socks. Honestly, he do make the billion look good. How? Because it, it, it looks like, fuck you, I'm doing whatever the fuck I want. Well, I'm down for that freedom. That's that's literally what I don't he like, looked like. I don't like what he does with his freedom. He looked like I'm wearing what I want. <laughs> he I don't say need what I want. I go what I want. I pop up what uh, I want. None of y'all can tell me shit. I like my new, new slave, Kanye. Put the invisible shackles back on him. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I like, do. I I do. Like, hey, hey, contrary to popular belief, I, I kind of was feeling Adidas, yay. <laughs> <laughs> like, I might not agree with all the shit that Kanye say, but I do like that he got the balls to say it. I, I, I disagree I like with that. most of that shit he say. But I do like the fact that he's he says it. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. But he's sounding yeah. nuts now. He's on some. I knew he wasn't going to let the beef die. He wasn't going to let. You think the Jewish shit was just going to come and, and go? Mm -mm. He was going to find a way to attach that shit to his Did you hear what he said? Album. His top three. Never mind. Man. Don't say it. Yeah. Not, yeah. Hell no. Don't say none of hell what he no. say. Uh, uh -uh. Yeah, please, please, uh -uh. Lord. You be careful what when this album comes out. Right. Gotta, Gotta sip, skip, make sure I don't play the right wrong song or yeah, something. Won't be no sleepers yeah, yeah. off that album. I'm not playing it. <laughs> Start rapping along and be like, oh, oh shit. shit. Wait, 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 hold on. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, that shit is the new nigger. <laughs> what? <laughs> Go ahead and catch yourself outside. I just fucked the Jewish. Wait, what? <laughs> you can't say, sing that out loud in every party. And drop the beat out. He did that. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. He did that. I got my own engineer. Hey, turn the beat on. <laughs> hey, Drown man. that shit. Hey, put, <laughs> hey, turn the beat extra loud <laughs> on that bar right there. I said, yo, that's, that's the billion, though. Did you or Parks ever sing Magic Stick in the club? <laughs> yes. Yeah, probably. Yeah, definitely, yep. actually. Uh, yeah, the yes. Of your lungs. Me too. Ever, probably recently. <laughs> Come on now. That's, I might the, that's, the, that's the shit to sing in the club. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. Fuck that. Kim's part? Nah. Nah, I ain't do that. I ain't gonna lie to you. Kind of bumble around with that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> but, when, then I get into it. Kim got a few songs that as men we shouldn't have sung, but we sung them. Facts. All them shits off that first. The whole first one. I dig tonight. It was like, Fair. oh my God. Fuck. Fair. Fair. Fuck. Neither do I, but. <laughs> That's very catchy. That's <laughs> shit. Fair. That's Fair. very catchy. The catchy. first line on that album. <laughs> These young girls, they are melodic. No, the first line on the album. I used to be scared of. Hey, <laughs> now throw lips to the shit. Hey. <laughs> Look at Mel, little laugh. <laughs> Look at Mel. <laughs> I am forever catching a string. Oh, man. Um, Those tunes were catchy. <laughs> Very catchy chords. <laughs> yeah. yeah, there you go. I'll tell you That's that. How they one. get you? <laughs> Holy shit! And Foxy stories get me too. Facts. Yeah. yeah. But Foxy is the one where I think it's acceptable. Like I think all men should sing "Get You Home Tonight" when they come on her verse. Uh, let's take it from the top. I Fox gets my swerve off, floor pure rock, and the six drop. Ooh, yeah, don't stop. See money looking all right. Yeah, what up? Yeah, that's the part when I get. I mean, I be rapping that shit to my man. I be be pointing. Yeah, what up? Flirting because I yo, digged you like that. Oh my god. Yo, me and Michael oh, Ball was at some party in South Carolina one time, and just this was when we was in our we just feel the music. Music days, right? And we cousins, so we ain't thinking like that. We rapping that shit to each other in the club. We looked around. The baddies was like, Ugh. <laughs> the girls, these niggas, yo, the girls here. that were staring at us all night, ready. It was like, Ugh. oh, that's, that's what they want. Oh, oh. ever think about how much oh, pussy you ruined for yourself just by, but, but from afar? You didn't say nothing. You didn't do nothing to your knowledge, but you did something to where she seen it. And, Kicked you off the list. Uh-huh. Kicked you off the pussy list. Yeah? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Or some of your associated with did some bullshit now. Now you can't get no pussy. Yeah, it's over for you. I bet that's happened to me a lot. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. I used to be real goofy. <laughs> I'm still kind of goofy. <laughs> <laughs> May pump it up, though. So. Balance that didn't do it. No, that ain't do it. That it wasn't, it that wasn't it enough. That wasn't enough. So to, to the niggas that ain't make pump it up? Well, That's yeah, it works on them. <laughs> today, these kids still don't even know I made Bumped Up. I was today years old when I learned. <laughs> oh, <laughs> fuck. Oh, man, yeah. <laughs> um, let me see, let me see. John Moran, 90s Bad, Draymond, Michael B. Jordan, John DeMajor. There's a clusterfuck out there. Yeah. Yeah. It's crazy. It really it was. And it seems like it ain't slowing down. 
Like usually shit slow down towards the end of the year. Facts. Yeah, holiday season. It's the holiday season. season. Everybody's supposed up. to be in the fucking spirit. This shit turned up. Yeah. Oh man, and guess what? It's about that time too. What happened? List time. Oh yeah, list is starting already. Yeah, so it's about to get even uglier out there. List is starting already. Okay. It's a hard year for lists. I was having a conversation with with a um, a rapper yesterday. I'm not gonna say his name. Oh, Wale. But, no. <laughs> and he was like, uh, "Your brother." No. <laughs> we were Joe. just. <laughs> yeah, well, no, no, <laughs> but no, we was just joking because I'm I'm trying to convince him to drop some uh, you know drop some music whatever. Mm. Oh, Kendrick. No, nigga, shut up. Jayla. And he was <laughs> he was like, yo, it's going to be real interesting. I want to see when these lists start popping up this year. Because he was like, this has been the worst year. This is the worst year music. I can remember. Mm -hmm. He was like, and it's crazy because there's so many lanes in rap or at this point. So it should be good. Good. You got a lane for every type of rap there is, and everybody's been trash. I just had to do my Grammy vote, and it was rough. It was just Sizz and Killer Mike. Yo, hold on, hold on, hold on. Even... Yo, 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 yo. You ain't got to just stun on niggas like that, though. Well, yeah, ain't a stun. I participate. Annoying. Yeah. It's, 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 it's really annoying voting. filling all that shit out. It is. It is. Because then you got a certain amount of votes, so like, oh, damn, I voted on something I shouldn't have. It, it's a pain in the ass, kind of. But we always complain about the Grammy, so I'm going to participate in this shit. Like, now that I have some juice, I'm going to... Yeah, I'm gonna play. Yeah, out. I'm gonna try to make something happen, but the lists Vote were, or die. The lists were tough. The lists were tough. I was sitting there because usually every year I put out, I do twenty, um, like my favorite albums of the year. Yeah, I was like, I couldn't even count I twenty. Can't get to twenty albums. Could this you year. even get to ten? I got four. I don't know if I can get favorite. To 10. I mean, I mm -hmm. I don't do that best, and I don't do all that shit. This, I just this is what I liked. Mm -hmm. I got four albums this year. That I, I feel like awards show season like is gonna really fucking suck because of the strike. Yeah. Um, and because this year in music was left a lot to be fucking desired, award show season is going to be like really fucking boring. I totally disagree with that. Really? I think award award season is going to be lit because of K two fentanyl, all of the drugs. <laughs> Yo, we're going to see these niggas do something stupid that they shouldn't do. We're going to see somebody wear something they shouldn't wear, say something they shouldn't say, and do something they, they shouldn't do. They're going to be sneaking food in the Grammys. They're going to be doing all types of wild shit. They're going to beef with somebody. Somebody might fight before or after the award ceremony. Robberies might be back. They gave you a year off last year, but they might be back and swoofing this year with inflation <laughs> and the recession. Um, what else? You might find out some old tea that reignites some new shit. Oh, it's nothing but old tea dropping. That's what I'm saying. I, I don't think that it's just going to be a eventless award. I think she's more so talking about the actual awards. Yeah, yeah, like the categories yeah, yeah. and like what's you know, nominated. Yeah. Well, that's what never changes. It's the personalities to do all the changing of the shit. Mm. The categories, the categories. All we need is for Kanye. Even if it ain't Kanye, know what I'm talking. Know, know what I'm really thinking about in my head, because in my head is more entertaining in real life. The Grammys are saying that they really contemplating uninviting Puff. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. In my head, Puff keep coming. <laughs> Show up anyway. Oh, with, it, with everybody deep too <laughs> white mink <laughs> he coming he coming helicopter hey y'all ain't want me yeah yeah land like, he, like, like he did the, the Halloween yeah, shit the Batman yeah. shit disrupt mm -hmm. all of this shit walk in with, as Batman or the Joker walk in as one of them walk in and disrupt all of that shit Do like, uh, walk in there and face your accusers walk, walk right up to Ryan Leslie somebody yeah. <laughs> all right maybe that's too far yeah maybe that's too far <laughs> walk up in there and the Will Smith slap shook the earth. Go, go in there in the mascot costume, the whole shit. They don't know it's you. You yeah. just in there the whole time. Yeah. Listen to who pop shit about you. Yeah, go in there. And, and then take the head, take the take the head off pause at the end of the night. So, yeah, yeah. That was me. I, I heard everything now, you said. That's now, my ver now. That's, now. Yeah. That's my version of the mask sing singer. <laughs> <laughs> that show is a real hit on Fox or wherever it is. Mm. That would mm -hmm. shake shit up. That would. That would hey, shake look at shit up. What up, E? What up, Kino? Okay. okay. Yeah, What's that happening? would shake shit up. I do, I do think we'll see something get shake, shook up at the awards. Not that I'm looking forward to that. We shall see. Mm -hmm. Some disruption, though. Yeah. Mel, did you have any... Uh, we, we talked about the um, Golden Globe noms. Did you have anything that stuck Who out to you? Who the fuck? Oh. Uh -oh. Fucking Barbie and Oppenheimer? Like, who's the that's nominees? Pretty much it. Yeah, that's pretty much it. There really was, like, not a whole lot of shit out there this year. It's true. It, cocaine Bear? The fuck? Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Hey, great movie. Oh, I really oh, enjoyed it. Right. But is it like up for Golden Globes or like Oscar or BAFTA nominations? That would be fucking crazy. That's what you'd be acting like sometimes. 
<laughs> you, co- you cocaine beer. No, it's more like cocaine chihuahua. <laughs> <laughs> Cocaine Chihuahua, Cocaine Daisy. Oh, shit. oh Lord. Cocaine Chihuahua. Did you see uh real quick in topics we already covered? Did you see uh that end of the world shit on Netflix? I mean, what's the name of it? Um, Last of the World, End of the World. The, leave the World. Leave the World. Leave behind. the World. Behind. Yeah. No. Okay. okay. No, I did not watch it. Okay. With Julia Roberts and Mahershala Ali. Yes. yes. I did not see it. Got it. Did you guys watch it? We did. Washed it, covered it, Kicked unpacked back it. In. Got it, okay. Shit it on it. Tossed it back and Heard forth. Heard it was trash. Yep. That, yeah. So that's why I was just like, eh, put that at the back of the, the back of the list. I was watching uh, Murder in Boston. Okay. Ooh, I'm not did you watch that? No. Okay. Doc? Word? Doc. Okay. Ooh. On HBO. Ooh. Mm. Talk to him now. Fire. Look, she, okay. know, she, she better not look this way. She's looking right at you. <laughs> no, you was looking at me. I'm looking at her. <laughs> Trying to make her look at me. <laughs> the little paragraph made me not want to watch it. Why? Boston has a history of race-related events that have led to it. All right, oh, you ain't making me sad and depressed. Oh, I'm making racy. With the history of Boston race-related uh, police issues? I ain't rushing to that while I'm in bed naked. <laughs> but I heard it was great. It is really good. It's really good. Not only did I hear it was great, I apparently know somebody that is related to that case that my mom told me about that. Mm. You, know? you gotta watch but it. But I heard it was good. Yeah, no, it's really good. Yeah, I, but I'm watching it like in the daytime or some shit. <laughs> but it's good. I remember um I remember when the case actually happened and it was just uh it's it's really fascinating. Like it's it's well it's a well told story, I'll say that. Okay. Yeah. Three episodes, two episodes have dropped. The next episode I think drops like Monday or something like that. Great. Yeah. Great. Mm. I don't think I have any other T V recommendations for the people out there. Well, we are on TV. We got to say rest in peace to Andre Brower. Oh, my absolutely. man. God, that was so oh, man. Listen, heartbreaking. Rest That's peace, my bro. man from Law and Order. Nah, Bayard Ellis. Homicide. Yeah. Whew, that Brooklyn was Brooklyn Nine-Nine. That's amazing. Brooklyn too. Nine-Nine. Glory. Yeah. I mean, he has a storied career. Yeah. His, his character and acting performance on Homicide, though, was like... One of the best ever in TV, in my opinion. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And probably set me down the path of liking all the super dark murder shows. Because that was early 90s, probably. Mm-hmm. Me and moms used to I was sad seeing love that, that shit. Yeah. Seeing that one come across. Mm-hmm. I had to do a little double take. Same. Make sure it was him. Lung cancer, they said. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Rest in peace. Rest mm-hmm. in peace to the legend. And thank you. Yeah, thank yeah, you. Yeah, thank you, man. Mm-hmm. Damn it! I'm going back to watch Homicide. That shit was incredible. I got to find it. it. It wasn't very long lived. It was like a crime show. It was a yeah. uh, Law and Order esque type of show. Check it out. Yeah, we're looking for something to watch now. Yeah, I'm, good show. I got two shows on Apple that I'm watching. What are you watching? Uh, Monarch. Is that the uh, Godzilla shit? Yeah, that shit looks fire. Is it fire? It is fire. And there's a movie. People were telling me um, Godzilla plus one or something like that. It's supposed to be insane. Okay. But um, they want Godzilla me to the theater again. Oh no, they got me. Mm-mm. They got a new Godzilla and Kong movie coming out next year. They got me with that too. <laughs> Trailer looked crazy. But um, I'm watching that one and then Slow Horses is back. Okay. I, I heard Slow that. Horses is so great. Fire. I heard it's Yarr. great. Oh, one was I've fire. never seen it. Is Fargo is back. Mm-hmm. And that show is great. It's the this Somebody one t- told me to watch Fargo. Recently. It's something it's something like it feels like a remix of the original movie a little bit. The story is somewhat similar to that. Mm-hmm. Okay. I'm kind of curious where they're going to take it. But the movie is an absolute classic. So, there, but there, there's twists already to it. So, but that's that shit series has been great. All four or five series seasons has been on. Mm-hmm. And in, in TV series news, Curb, Curb, man, it's coming back for one last, last season. Run. Final fi- twelve season. It's it's a uh, final season. Wow. Twelve twelve seasons is a lot of seasons. It is, mm-hmm. and it's been good pretty much all the twelve. I mean, a couple little lulls in the last couple of years, but man, what a series! It's gonna hurt hurt to see it go. It mm-hmm. is hurt to see it go, mm-hmm. but there's plenty of uh, plenty of episodes to go back and watch. So I'm not mad. Mm-hmm. Got got any uh, part of the show for us? I actually do. All from right. a gentleman named Mike Turner. I scrolled up for this one. This is short, sweet, and to the point. Okay. Do remember uh, to send in your questions to be a part of our part of the show. If they're good enough, we may even call you. Likely, we won't. But. <laughs> Let's see here. Mike Turner says, oh, oh, God. All right. Wait. Here we go. 
Please advise. I am one of the rare sauced up white boys. <laughs> Parks, Tyler Hero, Jack Harlow, JT, etc. <laughs> <laughs> okay, my fellow brother in sauce. <laughs> Is it weird or racist that I find pleasure in cracking girls who only hook up with black dudes? <laughs> That one and only white boy. Is that bad? Thanks. Parks. In advance. Uh, I can relate. I, I don't, don't know think that, that I ever found particular, like, extra pleasure in that fact. It's just kind of the way things went. That's not racist. I don't think it's racist. racist. Uh-huh. It's, it's more like elitist a little bit. It's, it's almost like... It's like, because I'm it's the only fetishizing? one that can do it. It's the opposite of racist, actually. You're trying to bring us together. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, like pulling, I, I, mm-hmm. it's like I got somewhere that y'all can't get to. Like she don't fuck with white boys, but you know what? I, I was, but I, I, was this one. I got it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So it's like I'm not it's, bad a, it's, at him. It's, it's an ego. It's, it's an ego pad. thing. Yeah. Yeah. I well, relate. And it sounds like he really likes black girls. Yeah. Well, you didn't specify because I, in my oh, he experience, girls. Yeah, yeah, girls. girls in general. Yeah. Like he said I, girls. I would date a lot of or sleep with a lot of white girls that usually only like black guys at one point in time in my life. So it could be any any race. I wish I were able to relate. Anytime they said, "Hey, I I don't fuck rappers," <laughs> I never. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? It's not quite the same when you when you fuck. I never felt like, hey, I was the rapper that got through. Like, <laughs> you don't kind of feel like that. Like, yeah, I never felt that way. But I I relate. He well, enjoys it. So he, he wearing it like a badge of honor. Yeah, sure. Touche yeah, for home. I don't think it's, it's racist. It's not racist, though. Not bro. racist. Go ahead and get all the pussy you can. Have, have at it, why don't you? Have a blast. Have a slice. <laughs> in the great words of Mel. <laughs> All right, man. We hope you enjoyed this podcast as much as we enjoyed delivering it to you. We want to send our well wishes to our good brother Ish. I'm sure he's in need of them right this second. Yeah, he might be a little sore. Flip, what do you know? We got through the whole pod and you didn't get a chance to make it, man. <laughs> that gone it. Crazy time to get that off during the contract negotiation. <laughs> Shout out to Miss Freeze, too. You know what I mean? Shout out to Miss Freeze. Speedy get better, get better, Miss Freeze. Big mm-hmm. missing piece. Mm-hmm. Big, big missing, missing piece. piece. Shout out to Mel, who got better. <laughs> <laughs> Mel, big Mel. Thank you for coming. Hey, to, hey, thank hey, you for hey, gracing hey, our hey, 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 Thanks hey, for. Hey. You know, yeah. Okay. That's what you got. Hey. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Relax. <laughs> Keep us in your prayers. Lord knows we need to be there until next time. I bid you adieu, farewell, adios, cerebinerci, hasta la vista, au revoir, and all that good stuff. Ego! Hopefully you have a real good weekend out there. I want to say again, happy birthday to my beautiful baby, Lex. I love you. Happy birthday, Lex. Happy birthday, Lex. It is also my grandmother, Jimmy's birthday. Rest in peace. I love you, Grandma. Rest in peace. Happy Happy birthday. birthday. Women are such a beacon of joy when they, like, love the guy. (laughs) Like... When they love him, they are so awesome to be around. Oh, that moment right before we fuck it up? Oh, God. Nightmare. Nightmare. Yo, remember life is a series of moments and moments pass, so let's make this one last as if it's all we have. All right, lastly, the baddies are insecure. The stagnant women want to... Hey, all right. Oh, shit. (laughs) The stagnant women want to travel, and the closed-minded women want you to teach them things. Grab you a Tylenol. You might need it. What's up? Any good weekend plans? Anybody? Uh, not major. Come on, let's not, not sound major. so loserish. <laughs> Lie. Come I'm on, say, somebody say something. Bit. I'm at the streets a little bit. Going to a cowboy game, going horseback <laughs> ride. Come on, lie. <laughs> the fuck? Fantasy football playoffs start this week. I don't know. About Fantasy that. football playoffs start this week. I wouldn't know. Okay, Shout out to Prize shit. Picks. We love you. We True. Do. I'm sharing the space right now with people that didn't make the fantasy playoffs. Oh my God. I want to shout out to Keeb for hitting <laughs> me five minutes before the Thursday night game, asking me if I wanted to pick up the Raiders defense off waiver wires. Thanks a lot, Keeb. <laughs> Thanks for not calling me about that one. They put up a historic performance. They did. 30 points on mm. the waiver wires. Oof. I needed that. I'm playing CC Sabathia. He's beat me two times in a row. Every point matters. Oof. Every point counts. Shout out to San Diego. They finally fired Brandon Staley yeah. and the GM. Knew that was coming. Knew that was coming. They got a long road ahead of them, too. That shit is a mess over there. Yeah, it's and bad. And it's L.A., not San Diego. But I still call them San Diego, too. Oh, yeah. They, the L.A. charges, <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. I'm old. Now. I do that same shit. I, they're still San Diego to me. Oh, my Lord. How could I have done that? <laughs> the L.A. Chargers. L.A. Chargers. Bye.
Ryan. JBP, JBP, why would you be without the JBP? Add the money, y'all. There's poor people around. <laughs> With your broke ass. <laughs> New Joe Biden.